أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful الحمد لله رب العالمين Praise be to Allah, Lord of the Worlds الرحمن الرحيم The Beneficent, the Merciful مالك يوم الدين Owner of the Day of Judgment إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين The alone we worship The alone we ask for help. Show us the straight path. The path of those whom thou hast favoured, not the path of those who earn thine anger, nor of those who go astray. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Alif Lam Meem. This is the scripture whereof there's no doubt, a guidance unto those who ward off evil. Who believe in the unseen and establish worship and spend of that we have bestowed upon them. And who believe in that which is revealed unto thee, Muhammad, and that which was revealed before thee, and are certain of the hereafter. These depend on guidance from their Lord. These are the successful. As for the disbelievers, whether thou warn them or thou warn them not, it is all one for them. They believe not. Allah hath sealed their hearing and their hearts, and on their eyes there's a covering. Theirs will be an awful doom. And of mankind are some who say, We believe in Allah and the last day, when they believe not. (laughs) 
they think to beguile Allah and those who believe, and they beguile none save themselves, but they perceive not. <laughs> In their hearts is a disease, and Allah increaseth their disease. A painful doom is theirs, because they lie. And when it is said unto them, Make not mischief in the earth, they say, we are peacemakers only. Are not they indeed the mischief makers, but they perceive not. And when it is said unto them, Believe as the people believe, they say, Shall we believe as the foolish believe? Are not they indeed the foolish? But they know not. And when they fall in with those who believe, they say, We believe. But when they go apart to their devils, they declare, Lo, we are with you. Verily, we did but mock. Allah Himself doth mock them, leaving them to wander blindly on in their contumacy. These are they who purchase error at the price of guidance, so their commerce doth not prosper, neither are they guided. <laughs> Their likeness is as the likeness of one who kindleth fire, and when it sheddeth its light around him, Allah taketh away their light and leaveth them in darkness where they cannot see. <laughs> Deaf, dumb and blind, and they return not. Oh, I 
Oh, like a rainstorm from the sky, wherein is darkness, thunder, and the flash of lightning. They thrust their fingers in their ears by reason of thunder claps for fear of death. Allah encompasseth the disbelievers in His guidance. <laughs> The lightning almost snatcheth away their sight from them. As often as it flasheth forth for them, they walk therein. And when it darkeneth against them, they stand still. If Allah willed, He could destroy their hearing and their sight. Lo, Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> O mankind, worship your Lord, who hath created you and those before you, so that ye may ward off evil. <laughs> Who hath appointed the earth a resting place for you, and the sky a canopy, and causeth water to pour down from the sky? thereby producing fruits as food for you. And do not set up rivals to Allah when you know better. <laughs> And if ye are in doubt concerning that which we reveal unto our slave Muhammad, then produce a surah of the like thereof. And call your witnesses beside Allah if ye are truthful. <laughs> And if ye do it not, and ye can never do it, then guard yourselves against the fire prepared for disbelievers, whose fuel is of men and stones.
And give glad tidings, O Muhammad, unto those who believe and do good works, that theirs are gardens underneath which rivers flow as often as they are regaled with food of the fruit thereof, they say. This is what was given us aforetime, and it is given to them in resemblance. There for them are pure companions, there forever they abide. <laughs> فَأَمَّا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا فَيَعْلَمُونَ أَنَّهُ الْحَقُّ مِنْ رَبِّهِمْ وَأَمَّا الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا فَيَقُولُونَ مَا Lo, Allah disdaineth not to coin the similitude even of a gnat. Those who believe know that it is the truth from their Lord. But those who disbelieve say, What doth Allah wish to teach by such a similitude? He misleadeth many thereby, and he guideth many thereby, and he misleadeth thereby only miscreants. <laughs> Those who break the covenant of Allah after ratifying it and sever that which Allah ordered to be joined and who make mischief in the earth, those are they who are the losers. <laughs> How disbelieve ye in Allah when ye were dead and he gave life to you? Then he will give you death, then life again, and then unto him ye will return. <laughs>
He it is who created for you all that is in the earth, then turned he to the heaven and fashioned it as seven heavens, and he is knower of all things. And when thy Lord said unto the angels, Lo, I am about to place a viceroy in the earth, they said, Wilt thou place therein one who will do harm therein, and will shed blood? While we, we hymn thy praise and sanctify thee? He said, Surely I know that which ye know not. <laughs> And he taught Adam all the names, then showed them to the angels, saying, Inform me of the names of these, if ye are truthful. <laughs> They said, Be glorified, we have no knowledge saving that which thou hast taught us. Lo, thou, only thou art the knower, the wise. He said, O Adam, inform them of their names. And when he had informed them of their names, he said, Did I not tell you that I know the secret of the heavens and the earth? And I know that which ye disclose and which ye hide. <laughs> And when we said unto the angels, Prostrate yourselves before Adam, they fell prostrate, all save Iblis. He demurred through pride, and so became a disbeliever. <laughs> to 
And we said, O Adam, dwell thou and thy wife in the garden, and eat ye freely of the fruits thereof, where ye will. But come not nigh this tree, lest ye become wrongdoers. But Satan caused them to deflect therefrom and expel them from the happy state in which they were. And we said, Fall down one of you, a foe unto the other. There shall be for you on earth a habitation and provision for a time. <laughs> Adam received from his Lord words of revelation, and he relented toward him. Lo, he is the relenting, the merciful. <laughs> We said, Go down, all of you, from hence. But verily there cometh unto you from me a guidance, and whoso followeth my guidance, there shall no fear come upon them, neither shall they grieve. <laughs> But they who disbelieve and deny our revelations, such are rightful owners of the fire. They will abide therein. <laughs> O children of Israel, remember my favor wherewith I favored you, and fulfill your part of the covenant. I shall fulfill my part of the covenant, and fear me. <laughs> ولا تكونوا أول كافر به ولا تشتروا بآياتي ثمنا قليلا وإياي فاتقون And believe in that which I reveal confirming that which ye possess already of the scripture and be not first to disbelieve therein, and part not with my revelations for a trifling price, and keep your duty unto me. <laughs>
Confound not truth with falsehood, nor knowingly conceal the truth. Establish worship, pay the poor due, and bow your heads with those who bow in worship. Enjoin ye righteousness upon mankind while ye yourselves forget to practice it? And ye are readers of the scripture. Have ye then no sense? Seek help in patience and prayer, and truly it is hard save for the humble minded. <laughs> who know that they will have to meet their Lord and that unto Him they are returning. children of Israel, remember my favor wherewith I favored you, and how I preferred you to all creatures. <laughs> لا يقبل منها شفاعة ولا يؤخذ منها عدل ولا هم ينصرون. And guard yourselves against a day when no soul will in aught avail another, nor will intercession be accepted from it, nor will compensation be received from it, nor will they be helped. وَإِذْ نَجَّيْنَاكُمْ مِنْ آلِ فِرْعَوْنَ يَسُومُونَكُمْ سُوءَ الْعَذَابِ يُذَبِّحُونَ أَبْنَاءَكُمْ وَيَسْتَحْيُونَ نِسَاءَكُمْ وَفِي ذَلِكُمْ And remember when we did deliver you from Pharaoh's folk, who were afflicting you with dreadful torment, slaying your sons and sparing your women, that was a tremendous trial from your Lord. <laughs> And when we brought you through the sea and rescued you and drowned the folk of Pharaoh in your sight. <laughs> And 
and when we did appoint for Moses forty nights of solitude, and then ye chose the calf when he had gone from you and were wrongdoers. <laughs> Then, even after that, we pardoned you in order that ye might give thanks. And when we gave unto Moses the scripture and the criterion of right and wrong, that ye might be led aright. وَإِذْ قَالَ مُوسَى لِقَوْمِهِ يَا قَوْمِ إِنَّكُمْ ظَلَمْتُمْ أَنفُسَكُمْ بِاتِّخَاذِكُمُ الْعِجْلَ فَتُوبُوا إِلَى بَارِئِكُمْ فَتُوبُوا إِلَى بَارِئِكُمْ فَاقْتُلُوا أَنفُسَكُمْ ذَلِكُمْ خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ عِنْدَ بَارِئِكُمْ فَتَابَ عَلَيْكُمْ إِنَّهُ هُوَ and when Moses said unto his people, O my people, ye have wronged yourselves by your choosing of the calf for worship, so turn in penitence to your Creator and kill the guilty yourselves. That will be best for you with your Creator, and he will relent toward you. Lo, he is the relenting, the merciful. وَإِذْ قُلْتُمْ يَا مُوسَىٰ لَن نُؤْمِنَ لَكَ حَتَّىٰ نَرَى اللَّهَ جَهْرَةً فَأَخَذَتْكُمُ الصَّاعِقَةُ وَأَنْتُمْ تَنْظُرُونَ And when ye said, O Moses, we will not believe in thee till we see Allah plainly, and even while ye gazed, the lightning seized you. Then we revived you after your extinction, that ye might give thanks. وَمَا ظَلَمُونَا وَلَكِنْ كَانُوا أَنفُسَهُمْ يَظْلِمُونَ And we caused the white cloud to overshadow you and sent down on you the manna and the quails, saying, Eat of the good things wherewith we have provided you. We wronged them not, but they did wrong themselves. And when we said, Go into this township and eat freely of that which is therein, and enter the gate prostrate, and say, Repentance. We will forgive you your sins and will increase reward for the right doers. Then 
But those who did wrong changed the word which had been told them for another saying, and we sent down upon the evildoers wrath from heaven for their evil doing. And when Moses asked for water for his people, we said, Smite with thy staff the rock. And there gushed out therefrom twelve springs, so that each tribe knew their drinking place. Eat and drink of that which Allah hath provided, and do not act corruptly, making mischief in the earth. <laughs> said, O Moses, we are weary of one kind of food, so call upon thy Lord for us, that he bring forth for us of that which the earth groweth, of its herbs, and its cucumbers, and its corn, and its lentils, and its onions. He said, Would ye exchange that which is higher for that which is lower? Go down to settled country, thus ye shall get that which ye demand. And humiliation and wretchedness were stamped upon them, and they were visited with wrath from Allah. That was because they disbelieved in Allah's revelations and slew the prophets wrongfully. That was for their disobedience and transgression. <laughs> Man, I'm an 
Lo, those who believe in that which is revealed unto thee, Muhammad, and those who are Jews and Christians and Sabaeans, whoever believeth in Allah and the last day and doth right, surely their reward is with their Lord, and there shall no fear come upon them, neither shall they grieve. <laughs> And remember, O children of Israel, when we made a covenant with you and caused the mount to tower above you, saying, Hold fast that which we have given you, and remember that which is therein, that he may ward off evil. <laughs> Then, even after that, ye turned away, and if it had not been for the grace of Allah and His mercy, ye had been among the losers. <laughs> And ye know of those of you who broke the Sabbath, how we said unto them, Be ye apes, despised and hated. And we made it an example to their own and to succeeding generations and an admonition to the God-fearing. And when Moses said unto his people, Lo, Allah commandeth you that ye sacrifice a cow, they said, Dost thou make game of us? He answered, Allah forbid that I should be among the foolish. <laughs> They said, Pray for us unto thy Lord, that he make clear to us what cow she is. Moses answered, Lo, he saith, Verily she is a cow neither with calf nor immature. She is between the two conditions, so do that which ye are commanded. <laughs> They said, Pray for us unto thy Lord, that he may clear to us of what color she is. 
Moses answered, Lo, he saith, Verily she is a yellow cow. Bright is her color, gladdening beholders. <laughs> They said, Pray for us unto thy Lord, that he make clear to us what cow she is. Lo, cows are much alike to us, and lo, if Allah wills, we may be led aright. <laughs> Moses answered, Lo, he saith, Verily she is a cow unyoked, she ploweth not the soil, nor watereth the tilth, whole and without mark. They said, Now thou bringest the truth, so they sacrificed her. Though almost they did not. <laughs> And remember when you slew a man and disagreed concerning it, and Allah brought forth that which ye were hiding. And we said, Smite him with some of it. Thus Allah bringeth the dead to life and showeth you his portents so that ye may understand. <laughs> Then even after that, your hearts were hardened and became as rocks, or worse than rocks, for hardness. For indeed there are rocks from out which rivers gush, and indeed there are rocks which split asunder so that water floweth from them, and indeed there are rocks which fall down for the fear of Allah. Allah is not unaware of what ye do. <laughs> Have ye any hope 
that they will be true to you when a party of them used to listen to the word of Allah, then used to change it after they had understood it knowingly. <laughs> And when they fall in with those who believe, they say, We believe. But when they go apart one with another, they say, Pray ye to them of that which Allah hath disclosed to you, that they may contend with you before your Lord concerning it. Have ye then no sense? <laughs> Are they then unaware that Allah knoweth that which they keep hidden and that which they proclaim? Among them are unlettered folk who know the scripture not except from hearsay. They but guess. Therefore, woe be unto those who write the scripture with their hands and then say, This is from Allah, that they may purchase a small gain therewith. Woe unto them for that their hands have written, and woe unto them for that they earn their pie. <laughs> And they say, the fire of punishment will not touch us, save for a certain number of days. Say, have ye received a covenant from Allah? Truly, Allah will not break his covenant, or tell ye concerning Allah that which ye know not. <laughs> Nay, but whosoever hath done evil and his sin surroundeth him, such are rightful owners of the fire. 
they will abide therein. And those who believe and do good works, such are rightful owners of the garden, they will abide therein. And remember, when we made a covenant with the children of Israel, saying, Worship none save Allah only, and be good to parents, and to kindred, and to orphans, and the needy, and speak kindly to mankind, and establish worship, and pay the poor due. Then after that, ye slid back, save a few of you, being averse. <laughs> And when we made with you a covenant saying, Shed not the blood of your people, nor turn a party of your people out of your dwellings. Then ye ratified our covenant, and ye were witnesses thereto. Yet ye it is who slay each other and drive out a party of your people from their homes, supporting one another against them by sin and transgression. And if they came to you as captives, ye would ransom them, 
whereas their expulsion was itself unlawful for you. Believe ye in part of the scripture, and disbelieve ye in part thereof? And what is the reward of those who do so, save ignominy in the life of the world, and on the day of resurrection they will be consigned to the most grievous doom, for Allah is not unaware of what ye do. <laughs> Such are those who buy the life of the world at the price of the hereafter. Their punishment will not be lightened, neither will they have support. فكلما جاءكم رسول بما لا تهوى أنفسكم استكبرتم ففريقا كذبتم وفريقا تقتلون And verily we gave unto Moses the scripture and we caused a train of messengers to follow after him, and we gave unto Jesus, son of Mary, clear proofs of Allah's sovereignty, and we supported him with the Holy Spirit. Is it ever so that when there cometh unto you a messenger from Allah, with that which ye yourselves desire not, ye grow arrogant, and some ye disbelieve, and some ye slay? <laughs> And they say, Our hearts are hardened. Nay, but Allah hath cursed them for their unbelief. Little is that which they believe. And when there cometh unto them a scripture from Allah, confirming that in their possession, though before that they were asking for a signal triumph over those who disbelieved, and when there cometh unto them that which they know to be the truth, they disbelieve therein. The curse of Allah is on disbelievers. Evil is that for which they sell their souls, 
that they should disbelieve in that which Allah hath revealed, grudging that Allah should reveal of his bounty unto whom he will of his bondmen. They have incurred anger upon anger, for disbelievers is a shameful doom. <laughs> And when it is said unto them, Believe in that which Allah hath revealed, they say, We believe in that which was revealed unto us. And they disbelieve in that which cometh after it, though it is the truth confirming that which they possess. Say unto them, O Muhammad, why then slew ye the prophets of Allah aforetime, if ye are indeed believers? <laughs> And Moses came unto you with clear proofs of Allah's sovereignty. Yet while he was away, ye chose the car for worship, and ye were wrongdoers. <laughs> And when we made with you a covenant and caused the mount to tar above you, saying, Hold fast by that which we have given you, and hear our word, they said, We hear and we rebel and worship of the calf was made to sink into their hearts because of their rejection of the covenant. Say unto them, Evil is that which your belief enjoineth on you if ye are believers. <laughs> Say unto them, If the abode of the hereafter in the providence of Allah is indeed for you alone and not for others of mankind as ye pretend, then long for death, for ye must long for death, if ye are truthful. <laughs> But they will never long for it because of that which their own hands have sent before them. Allah is aware of evildoers. <laughs> 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 
And thou wilt find them greediest of mankind for life and greedier than the idolaters. Each one of them would like to be allowed to live a thousand years, and to live a thousand years would by no means remove him from the doom. Allah is seer of what they do. <laughs> Say, O Muhammad, to mankind, who is an enemy to Gabriel? For he it is who hath revealed the scripture to thy heart by Allah's leave, confirming that which was revealed before it, and a guidance and glad tidings to believers. <laughs> is an enemy to Allah and his angels and his messengers and Gabriel and Michael, then lo, Allah himself is an enemy to the disbelievers. <laughs> Verily, we have revealed unto thee clear tokens, and only miscreants will disbelieve in them. <laughs> Is it ever so that when they make a covenant, a party of you set it aside? The truth is, most of you believe not. <laughs> And when there cometh unto them a messenger from Allah, confirming that which they possess, a party of those who have received the scripture fling the scripture of Allah behind their backs as if they knew not. <laughs> وَلَكِنَّ الشَّيَاطِينَ 
And follow that which the devils falsely related against the kingdom of Solomon. Solomon disbelieved not, but the devils disbelieved, teaching mankind magic and that which was revealed to the two angels in Babel, Haruth and Maruth. Nor did they, the two angels, teach it to anyone till they had said, We are only a temptation, therefore disbelieve not in the guidance of Allah. And from these two angels people learn that by which they cause division between man and wife, but they injure thereby no one save by Allah's leave. And they learn that which harmeth them, and profiteth them not. And surely they do know that he who trafficketh therein will have no happy portion in the hereafter. And surely evil is the price for which they sell their souls if they but knew. <laughs> لو كانوا يعلمون. And if they had believed and kept from evil, a recompense from Allah would be better if they only knew. يا أيها الذين آمنوا لا تقولوا راعنا وقولوا انظرنا واسمعوا O ye who believe, say not unto the Prophet, Listen to us, but say, Look upon us, and be ye listeners, for disbelievers is a painful doom. Neither those who disbelieve among the people of the scripture nor the idolaters love that there should be sent down unto you any good thing from your Lord. But Allah chooseth for his mercy whom he will. 
and Allah is of infinite bounty. <laughs> Such of our revelations as we abrogate a cause to be forgotten, we bring in place, one better, or the like thereof. Knowest thou not that Allah is able to do all things? <laughs> Knowest thou not that it is Allah unto whom belongeth the sovereignty of the heavens and earth, and ye have not beside Allah any friend or helper? أَمْ تُرِيدُونَ أَن تَسْأَلُوا رَسُولَكُمْ كَمَا سُئِلَ مُوسَى مِنْ قَبْلِ وَمَنْ يَتَبَدَّلِ الْكُفْرَ بِالْإِيمَانِ فَقَدْ ضَلَّ سَوَاءَ السَّبِيلِ or would ye question your messenger as Moses was questioned aforetime? He who chooseth disbelief instead of faith, verily he hath gone astray from a plain road. <laughs> Many of the people of the scripture long to make you disbelievers after your belief, through envy on their own account, after the truth hath become manifest unto them. Forgive and be indulgent toward them until Allah give command. Lo, Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> Establish worship and pay the poor due, and whatever of good ye send before you for your souls, ye will find it with Allah. Lo, Allah is seer of what ye do. <laughs> And they say, None entereth paradise unless he be a Jew or a Christian. These are their own desires. Say, Bring your proof of what ye state if ye are truthful. Oh, 
yahzanun nay but whosoever surrendereth his purpose to allah while doing good his reward is with his lord and there shall no fear come upon them neither shall they grieve wa qalat al-yahud laysat an-nasara ala And the Jews say the Christians follow nothing true, and the Christians say the Jews follow nothing true, yet both are readers of the scripture. Even thus speak those who know not. Allah will judge between them on the day of resurrection concerning that wherein they differ. And who doth greater wrong than he who forbiddeth the approach to the sanctuaries of Allah, lest his name should be mentioned therein, and striveth for their ruin? As for such, it was never meant that they should enter them except in fear. Theirs in the world is ignominy, and theirs in the hereafter is an awful doom. Unto Allah belong the East and the West, and whithersoever ye turn, there's Allah's countenance. Lo, Allah is all-embracing, all-knowing. <laughs> And they say, Allah hath taken unto himself a son, be he glorified. Nay, but whatsoever is in the heaven and the earth is his, all are subservient unto him. <laughs> The originator of the heavens and the earth, when he decreeth a thing, he saith unto it only, Be, and it is. <laughs> كَذَلِكَ قَالَ الَّذِينَ مِنْ قَبْلِهِمْ مِثْلَ قَوْلِهِمْ تَشَابَهَتْ قُلُوبُهُمْ قَدْ بَيَّنَّ الْآيَاتِ لِقَوْمٍ يُوقِنُونَ 
and those who have no knowledge say, Why doth not Allah speak unto us, or some sign come unto us? Even thus, as they now speak, spake those who were before them, their hearts are all alike. We have made clear the revelations for people who are sure. <laughs> Lo, we have sent thee, O Muhammad, with the truth, a bringer of glad tidings and a warner, and thou wilt not be asked about the owners of hell fire. <laughs> And the Jews will not be pleased with thee, nor will the Christians, till thou follow their creed. Say, Lo, the guidance of Allah Himself is guidance, and if thou shouldst follow their desires after the knowledge which hath come unto thee, then wouldst thou have from Allah no protecting friend nor helper. <laughs> وَمَن يَكْفُرْ بِهِ فَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْخَاسِرُونَ Those unto whom we have given the scripture, who read it with the right reading, those believe in it. And whoso disbelieveth in it, those are they who are the losers. يَا بَنِي O children of Israel, remember my favor wherewith I favored you and how I preferred you to all creatures. <laughs> And guard yourselves against a day when no soul will in aught avail another, nor will compensation be accepted from it, nor will intercession be of use to it, nor will they be helped. <laughs> And remember, when his Lord tried Abraham with his commands, and he fulfilled them, he said, Lo, I have appointed thee a leader for mankind. Abraham said, And of my offspring will there be leaders? He said, 
my covenant included not wrongdoers. اتخذوا من مقام ابراهيم مصلى وعهدنا الى ابراهيم واسماعيل ان طهر بيتي وعهدنا الى And when we made the house at Mecca a resort for mankind and a sanctuary, saying, Take as your place of worship the place where Abraham stood to pray, and we imposed a duty upon Abraham and Ishmael, saying, Purify my house for those who go around and those who meditate therein, and those who bow down and prostrate themselves in worship. <laughs> من آمن منهم بالله واليوم الآخر قال ومن كفر فأمتعه قليلا ثم أضطره إلى عذاب النار وبئس المصير and when Abraham prayed, My Lord, make this a region of security and bestow upon its people fruits, such of them as believe in Allah and the last day, he answered, As for him who disbelieveth, I shall leave him in contentment for a while, then I shall compel him to the doom of fire, a hapless journey's end. <laughs> And when Abraham and Ishmael were raising the foundations of the house, Abraham prayed, Our Lord, accept from us this duty. Lo, Thou, only Thou art the hearer, the knower. <laughs> Our Lord, and make us submissive unto Thee, and of our seed a nation submissive unto Thee, and show us our ways of worship, and relent toward us. Lo, Thou, only Thou art the relenting, the merciful. <laughs> Ayat 
يَأْتِكَ وَيُعَلِّمُهُمُ الْكِتَابَ وَالْحِكْمَةَ وَيُزَكِّيهِمْ إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْعَزِيزُ الْحَكِيمُ Our Lord, and raise up in their midst a messenger from among them, who shall recite unto them thy revelations, and shall instruct them in the scripture, and in wisdom, and shall make them grow. Lo, thou, only thou art the mighty wise. وَلَقَدْ اصْطَفَيْنَاهُ فِي الدُّنْيَا وَإِنَّهُ فِي الْآخِرَةِ لَمِنَ الصَّالِحِينَ And who forsaketh the religion of Abraham save him who befooleth himself? Verily, we chose him in the world, and lo, in the hereafter, he is among the righteous. إِذْ قَالَ لَهُ رَبُّهُ أَسْلِمْ قَالَ أَسْلَمْتُ لِرَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ When his Lord said unto him, Surrender, he said, I have surrendered to the Lord of the worlds. The same did Abraham enjoin upon his sons and also Jacob, saying, O my sons, lo, Allah hath chosen for you the true religion. Therefore, die not save as men who have surrendered unto him. ye present when death came to Jacob when he said unto his sons what will ye worship after me they said we shall worship thy God the God of thy fathers Abraham and Ishmael and Isaac one God and unto him we have surrendered <laughs> Those are a people who have passed away. Theirs is that which they earned, and yours is that which ye earn. And ye will not be asked of what they used to do. وَقَالُوا كُونُوا هُودًا أَوْ نَصَارَى تَهْتَدُوا قُلْ بَلْ مِلَّةَ إِبْرَاهِيمَ حَنِيفًا وَمَا كَانَ مِنَ الْمُشْرِكِينَ And they say, be Jews or Christians, then ye will be rightly guided. Say unto them, O Muhammad, Nay, but we follow the religion of Abraham, the upright, and he was not of the idolaters. <laughs> 
Say, O Muslims, we believe in Allah and that which is revealed unto us and that which was revealed unto Abraham and Ishmael and Isaac and Jacob and the tribes and that which Moses and Jesus received and that which the prophets received from their Lord. We make no distinction between any of them and unto him we have surrendered. In Amanu Bimithlima Amantum Bihi Fakadil Tadaw Wa In Tawallahu Fa Innama Hum Fi Shikaqin Fa Sayakfika Hum Allah And if they believe in the like of that which ye believe, then are they rightly guided. But if they turn away, then are they in schism, and Allah will suffice thee for defense against them. He is the hearer, the knower. <laughs> We take our color from Allah, and who is better than Allah at coloring? We are His worshippers. Say unto the people of the scripture, Dispute ye with us concerning Allah when he is our Lord and your Lord? Ours are our works and yours your works. We look to him alone. <laughs> O 
O say ye that Abraham and Ishmael and Isaac and Jacob and the tribes were Jews or Christians? Say, do ye know best or doth Allah? And who is more unjust than he who hideth a testimony which he hath received from Allah? Allah is not unaware of what ye do. Those are a people who have passed away. Theirs is that which they earned, and yours that which ye earned. And ye will not be asked of what they used to do. The foolish of the people will say, What hath turned them from the Qibla which they formerly observed? Say, Unto Allah belong the East and the West. He guideth whom He will unto a straight path. Thus we have appointed you a middle nation, that ye may be witnesses against mankind, and that the messenger may be a witness against you. And we appointed the Qibla, which ye formerly observed, only that we might know him who followed the messenger, from him who turneth on his heels. In truth, it was a hard test save for those whom Allah guided. But it was not Allah's purpose that your faith should be in vain, for Allah is full of pity, merciful towards mankind. <laughs> Allah 
We have seen the turning of thy face to heaven for guidance, O Muhammad. And now verily we shall make thee turn in prayer toward a qibla which is dear to thee. So turn thy face toward the inviolable place of worship, and ye, O Muslims, wheresoever ye may be, turn your faces when ye pray toward it. Lo, those who have received the scripture know that this revelation is the truth from their Lord, and Allah is not unaware of what they do. And even if you broughtest unto those who have received the scripture all kinds of portents, they would not follow thy qibla nor canst thou be a follower of their qibla, nor are some of them followers of the qibla of others. And if thou shouldst follow their desires after the knowledge which hath come unto thee, then surely wert thou of the evildoers. <laughs> Those unto whom we gave the scripture recognize this revelation as they recognize their sons. But lo, a party of them knowingly conceal the truth. <laughs> It is the truth from thy Lord, O Muhammad, so be not thou of those who waver. And each one hath a goal toward which he turneth, so why with one another in good works? Wheresoever ye may be, Allah will bring you all together. Lo, Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> And whensoever thou comest forth for prayer, O Muhammad, turn thy face toward the inviolable place of worship. Lo, it is the truth from thy Lord. Allah is not unaware of what ye do. Wahaithumakum 
Whensoever thou comest forth, turn thy face toward the inviolable place of worship. And wheresoever ye may be, O Muslims, turn your faces towards it when ye pray, so that men may have no argument against you, save such of them as do injustice. Fear them not, but fear me, and so that I may complete my grace upon you, and that ye may be guided. Even as we have sent unto you a messenger from among you, who reciteth unto you our revelations, and causeth you to grow, and teacheth you the scripture and wisdom, and teacheth you that which ye knew not. <laughs> Therefore, remember me, I will remember you. Give thanks to me and reject not me. <laughs> believe, seek help in steadfastness and prayer. Lo, Allah is with the steadfast. <laughs> Call not those who are slain in the way of Allah dead. Nay, they are living. Only ye perceive not. <laughs> And surely we shall try you with something of fear and hunger and loss of wealth and lives and crops, but give glad tidings to the steadfast. <laughs> Say, when a misfortune striketh them, lo, we are Allah's, and lo, unto Him we are returning. <laughs> Him 
Such are they on whom are blessings from their Lord and mercy. Such are the rightly guided. <laughs> Lo, the mountains as Safa and Al Marwa are among the indications of Allah. It is therefore no sin for him who is on pilgrimage to the house of God or visiteth it to go around them as the pagan custom is. And he who doth good of his own accord, for him, lo, Allah is responsive, aware. <laughs> Those who hide the proofs and the guidance which we revealed after we had made it clear in the scripture, such are accursed of Allah and accursed of those who have the power to curse. <laughs> Except those who repent and amend and make manifest the truth, these it is toward whom I relent. I am the relenting, the merciful. <laughs> Lo, those who disbelieve and die while they are disbelievers, on them is the curse of Allah and of angels and of men combined. <laughs> They ever dwell therein. The doom will not be lightened for them, neither will they be reprieved. Your God is one God. There's no God save Him, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Bye. 
Lo, in the creation of the heavens and the earth, and the difference of night and day, and the ships which run upon the sea, with that which is of use to men, and the water which Allah sendeth down from the sky, thereby reviving the earth after its death, and dispersing all kinds of beasts therein, and in the ordinance of the winds and the clouds, obedient between heaven and earth, are signs of Allah's sovereignty for people who have sins. <laughs> Yet of mankind are some who take unto themselves objects of worship which they set as rivals to Allah, loving them with a love like that which is the due of Allah only. Those who believe are stauncher in their love for Allah. Oh, that those who do evil had but known on the day when they behold the doom that power belongeth wholly to Allah, and that Allah is severe in punishment. If the Bora and Levina to be mean and Levina to be a Ulla, but a part be him as on the day when those who have followed disown those who followed them and they behold the doom and all their aims collapse with them. And those who were but followers will say, If a return were possible for us, we would disown them, even as they have disowned us. Thus will Allah show them their own deeds as anguish for them and they will not emerge from the fire. <laughs> Inna 
O mankind, eat of that which is lawful and wholesome in the earth, and follow not the footsteps of the devil. Lo, he is an open enemy for you. <laughs> He enjoineth upon you only the evil and the foul, and that ye should tell concerning Allah that which ye know not. And when it is said unto them, Follow that which Allah hath revealed, they say, We follow that wherein we found our fathers. What, even though their fathers were wholly unintelligent and had no guidance? <laughs> The likeness of those who disbelieve in relation to the messenger is as the likeness of one who calleth unto that which heareth not except a shout and cry. Deaf, dumb, blind, therefore they have no sense. O ye who believe, eat of the good things wherewith we have provided you, and render thanks to Allah, if it is indeed He whom ye worship. <laughs> He hath forbidden you only carrion and blood and swine flesh and that which hath been immolated to the name of any other than Allah. But he who is driven by necessity, neither craving nor transgressing, it is no sin for him. Lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> Yeah. 
Lo, those who hide aught of the scripture which Allah hath revealed and purchase a small gain therewith, they eat into their bellies nothing else than fire. Allah will not speak to them on the day of resurrection, nor will he make them grow. Theirs will be a painful doom. <laughs> Those are they who purchase error at the price of guidance and torment at the price of pardon. How constant are they in their strife to reach the fire? That is because Allah hath revealed the scripture with the truth. Lo, those who find a cause of disagreement in the scripture are in open schism. <laughs> It is not righteousness that you turn your faces to the east and the west, but righteous is he who believeth in Allah and the last day and the angels and the scripture and the prophets and giveth his wealth for love of him to kinsfolk and to orphans and the needy and the wayfarer and to those who ask and to set slaves free and observeth proper worship and payeth the poor due and those who keep their treaty when they make one and the patient in tribulation and adversity and time of stress. Such are they who are sincere. Such are the God-fearing. <laughs>
فمن عفي له من أخيه شيء فاتباع بالمعروف وأداء إليه بإحسان ذلك تخفيف فمن اعتدى بعد ذلك فله عذاب أليم O ye who believe, retaliation is prescribed for you in the matter of the murdered, the freeman for the freeman, and the slave for the slave, and the female for the female, and for him who is forgiven somewhat by his injured brother. Prosecution according to usage and payment unto him in kindness. This is an alleviation and a mercy from your Lord. He who transgresseth after this will have a painful doom. <laughs> There's life for you in retaliation, O men of understanding, that ye may ward off evil. <laughs> It is prescribed for you when death approaches one of you, if he leave wealth, that he bequeath unto parents and near relatives in kindness. This is a duty for all those who ward off evil. <laughs> Whoso changeth the will after he hath heard it, the sin thereof is only upon those who change it. Lo, Allah is hearer, knower. <laughs> But he who fareth from a testator some unjust or sinful clause, and maketh peace between the parties, it shall be no sin for him. Lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> O ye who believe, fasting is prescribed for you even as it was prescribed for those before you, that ye may ward off evil. <laughs> Fasting 
fast a certain number of days, and for him who is sick among you, or on a journey, the same number of other days, and for those who can afford it, there is a ransom, the feeding of a man in need. But whoso doth good of his own accord, it is better for him, and that he fast is better for you, if ye did but know. <laughs> The month of Ramadan in which was revealed the Qur'an, a guidance for mankind and clear proofs of the guidance and the criterion of right and wrong. And whosoever of you is present, let him fast the month, and whosoever of you is sick or on a journey, let him fast the same number of other days. Allah desireth for you ease. He desireth not hardship for you. And he desireth that ye should complete the period, and that ye should magnify Allah for having guided you, and that peradventure ye may be thankful. <laughs> And when my servants question thee concerning me, then surely I am nigh. I answer the prayer of the suppliant when he crieth unto me. So let them hear my call and let them trust in me in order that they may be led aright. أُحِلَّ لَكُمْ لَيْلَةَ الصِّيَامِ الرَّفَثُ إِلَى نِسَائِكُمْ هُنَّ لِبَاسٌ لَكُمْ وَأَنْتُمْ لِبَاسٌ لَهُمْ عَلِمَ اللَّهُ أَنَّكُمْ كُنْتُمْ تَخْتَانُونَ أَنفُسَكُمْ فَتَابَ عَلَيْكُمْ وَعَفَا عَنْكُمْ فَتَابَ عَلَيْكُمْ وَعَفَا عَنْكُمْ وَكُلُوا وَاشْرَبُوا حَتَّى يَتَبَيَّنَ لَكُمُ الْخَيْطُ الْأَبِيَضُ مِنَ الْخَيْطِ الْأَسْوَدِ مِنَ الْفَجْرِ ثُمَّ أَتِمُّ الصِّيَامَ إِلَى اللَّيْلِ وَلَا تُبَعَّنَ Till 
It is made lawful for you to go unto your wives on the night of the fast. They are raiment for you and ye are raiment for them. Allah is aware that ye were deceiving yourselves in this respect and he hath turned in mercy toward you and relieved you. So hold intercourse with them and seek that which Allah hath ordained for you and eat and drink until the white thread becometh distinct to you from the black thread of the dawn. Then strictly observe the fast till nightfall and touch them not but be at your devotions in the mosques. These are the limits imposed by Allah so approach them not Thus Allah expounded his revelations to mankind that they may ward off evil. <laughs> Eat not up your property among yourselves in vanity, nor seek by it to gain the hearing of the judges, that ye may knowingly devour a portion of the property of others wrongfully. <laughs> They ask thee, O Muhammad, of new moons. Say, they are fixed seasons for mankind and for the pilgrimage. It is not righteousness that ye go to houses by the backs thereof, as do the idolaters at certain seasons. But the righteous man is he who wardeth off evil. So go to the houses by the gates thereof and observe your duty to Allah that he may be successful. <laughs> Fight in the way of Allah against those who fight against you, but begin not hostilities. Lo, Allah loveth not aggressors. <laughs> And slay them wherever ye find them, and drive them out of the places whence they drove you out, for persecution is worse than slaughter. And fight not with them at the inviolable place of worship, until they first attack you there. 
But if they attack you there, then slay them. Such is the reward of disbelievers. <laughs> But if they desist, then lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. Fight them until persecution is no more, and religion is for Allah. But if they desist, then let there be no hostility except against wrongdoers. <laughs> The forbidden month for the forbidden month and forbidden things in retaliation. And one who attacketh you, attack him in like manner as he attacked you. Observe your duty to Allah. And know that Allah is with those who ward off evil. Spend your wealth for the cause of Allah and be not cast by your own hands to ruin and do good. Lo, Allah loveth the beneficent. <laughs> Perform the pilgrimage and the visit to Mecca for Allah. And if ye are prevented, then send such gifts as can be obtained with ease, and shave not your heads until the gifts have reached their destination. And whoever among you is sick, 
or hath an ailment of the head must pay a ransom of fasting or almsgiving or offering. And if ye are in safety, then whosoever contenteth himself with the visit for the pilgrimage shall give such gifts as can be had with ease. And whosoever cannot find such gifts, then a fast of three days while on the pilgrimage, and of seven when ye have returned, that is, ten in all. That is for him whose folk are not present at the inviolable place of worship. Observe your duty to Allah, and know that Allah is severe in punishment. <laughs> The pilgrimage is in the well-known months, and whoever is minded to perform the pilgrimage therein, let him remember that there is to be no lewdness, nor abuse, nor angry conversation on the pilgrimage. And whatsoever good ye do, Allah knoweth it. So make provision for yourselves hereafter, for the best provision is to ward off evil. Therefore, keep your duty unto me, O men of understanding. ليس عليكم جناح أن تبتغوا فضلا من ربكم فإذا أفضتم من عرفات فاذكروا الله عند المشعر الحرام واذكروا واذكروه كما هداكم وإن كنتم من قبله لمن الضالين. It is no sin for you that you seek the bounty of your Lord by trading. But when ye press on in the multitude from Arafat, remember Allah by the sacred monument. Remember him as he hath guided you, although before ye were of those astray. <laughs> Then hasten onward from the place whence the multitude hasteneth onward, and ask forgiveness of Allah. Lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> فَمِنَ النَّاسِ مَنْ يَقُولُ رَبَّنَا آتِنَا فِي الدُّنْيَا وَمَا لَهُ فِي الْآخِرَةِ مِنْ خَلَاقٍ And when ye have completed your devotions, then remember Allah as ye remember your fathers, or with a more lively remembrance. But of mankind is he who saith, Our Lord, give unto us in the world, and he hath no portion in the hereafter. <laughs> دُنْيَا 
حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار. And of them also is he who saith, Our Lord, give unto us in the world that which is good, and in the hereafter that which is good, and guard us from the doom of fire. For them there is in store a goodly portion out of that which they have earned. Allah is swift at reckoning. And remember Allah through the appointed days, then whoso hasteneth his departure by two days, it is no sin for him, and whoso delayeth, it is no sin for him. That is for him who wardeth off evil. Be careful of your duty to Allah, and know that unto him ye'll be gathered. <laughs> of mankind there's he whose conversation on the life of this world pleaseth thee Muhammad and he calleth Allah to witness as to that which is in his heart yet he is the most rigid of opponents <laughs> And when he turneth away from thee, his effort in the land is to make mischief therein and to destroy the crops and the cattle. And Allah loveth not mischief. And when it is said unto him, Be careful of thy duty to Allah, pride taketh him to sin. Hell will settle his account, an evil resting place. And of mankind is he who would sell himself seeking the pleasure of Allah, and Allah hath compassion on his bondman. Ye who believe, come all of you into submission unto him, and follow not the footsteps of the devil. 
Lo, he is an open enemy for you. And if ye slide back after the clear proofs have come unto you, then know that Allah is mighty wise. Wait they for naught else than that Allah should come unto them in shadows of the clouds with the angels? Then the case would be already judged. All cases go back to Allah for judgment. Ask of the children of Israel how many a clear revelation we gave them. He who altereth the grace of Allah after it hath come unto him for him, lo, Allah is severe in punishment. <laughs> والذين اتقوا فوقهم يوم القيامة والله يرزق من يشاء بغير حساب Beautified is the life of the world for those who disbelieve. They make a jest of the believers, but those who keep their duty to Allah will be above them on the day of resurrection. Allah giveth without stint to whom he will. Mankind were one community, and Allah sent unto them prophets as bearers of good tidings, and as warners, and revealed therewith the scripture with the truth, that it might judge between mankind concerning that wherein they deferred. And only those unto whom the scripture was given deferred concerning it, after clear proofs had come unto them, through hatred one of another. 
and Allah by His will guided those who believe unto the truth of that concerning which they deferred. Allah guideth whom He will unto a straight path. <laughs> Think ye that ye will enter paradise while yet there have not come unto you the like of that which came to those who passed away before you? Affliction and adversity befell them, they were shaken as with earthquake, till the Messenger of Allah and those who believed along with him said, When cometh Allah's help? Now surely Allah's help is nigh. يسألونك ماذا ينفقون قل ما أنفقتم من خير فللوالدين والأقربين واليتامى والمساكين وابن السبيل وما تفعلوا من خير فإن الله به عليم. They ask thee, O Muhammad, what they shall spend, say, that which ye spend for good must go to parents and their kindred and orphans and the needy and the wayfarer. And whatsoever good ye do, lo, Allah is aware of it. كتب عليكم القتال وهو كره لكم وعسى أن تكرهوا شيئا وهو خير لكم وعسى أن تكرهوا شيئا وهو خير Warfare is ordained for you, though it is hateful unto you, but it may happen that ye hate a thing which is good for you, and it may happen that ye love a thing which is bad for you. Allah knoweth, ye know not. Yeah. 
They question thee, O Muhammad, with regard to warfare in the sacred month. Say, warfare therein is a great transgression, but to turn men from the way of Allah and to disbelieve in Him and in the inviolable place of worship and to expel His people thence is a greater with Allah. For persecution is worse than killing, and they will not cease from fighting against you till they have made you renegades from your religion. if they can and whoso becometh a renegade and dieth in his disbelief such are they whose works have fallen both in the world and the hereafter such are rightful owners of the fire they will abide therein <laughs> Lo, those who believe and those who emigrate to escape the persecution and strive in the way of Allah, these have hope of Allah's mercy. Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> They question thee about strong drink and games of chance, say, In both is great sin and some utility for men, but the sin of them is greater than their usefulness. And they ask thee what they ought to spend, say, that which is superfluous. Thus Allah make it plain to you his revelations, that haply ye may reflect. <laughs> Upon the world and the hereafter, and they question thee concerning orphans, say, To improve their lot is best, and if ye mingle your affairs with theirs, then they are your brothers. Allah knoweth him who spoileth from him who improveth. Had Allah willed, he could have overburdened you. Allah is mighty wise. <laughs> ولا تنكحوا المشركين حتى يؤمنوا 
Wed not idolatresses till they believe, for lo, a believing bondwoman is better than an idolatress, though she please you. And give not your daughters in marriage to idolaters till they believe, for lo, a believing slave is better than an idolater, though he please you. These invite unto the fire, and Allah inviteth unto the garden, and unto forgiveness by His grace, and expounded thus his revelations to mankind that haply they may remember. <laughs> ولا تقربوهن حتى يطهرن فإذا تطهرن فأتوهن من حيث أمركم الله إن الله يحب التوابين ويحب They question thee, O Muhammad, concerning menstruation. Say, It is an illness, so let women alone at such times, and go not in unto them till they are cleansed. And when they have purified themselves, then go in unto them, as Allah hath enjoined upon you. Truly Allah loveth those who turn unto Him and loveth those who have a care for cleanness. <laughs> Your women are a tilth for you to cultivate, so go to your tilth as ye will, and send good deeds before you for your souls, and fear Allah, and know that ye will one day meet Him. Give glad tidings to believers, O Muhammad. <laughs> And make not Allah by your oaths a hindrance to your being righteous and observing your duty unto Him and making peace among mankind. Allah is Hera, Noah. Allah will not take you to task for that which is unintentional in your oaths, but He will take you to task for that which your hearts have garnered. Allah is forgiving, clement. <laughs> Oh, 
Those who forswear their wives must wait four months. Then, if they change their mind, lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. And if they decide upon divorce, let them remember that Allah is Hera, Noah. Women who are divorced shall wait, keeping themselves apart three monthly courses. And it is not lawful for them that they should conceal that which Allah hath created in their wombs if they are believers in Allah and the last day. And their husbands would do better to take them back in that case if they desire a reconciliation. And they women have rights similar to those of men over them in kindness, and men are a degree above them. Allah is mighty wise. <laughs> Divorce must be pronounced twice, and then a woman must be retained in honor or released in kindness. And it is not lawful for you that ye take from women aught of that which ye have given them, except in the case when both fear that they may not be able to keep within the limits imposed by Allah. And if ye fear that they may not be able to keep the limits of Allah, in that case it is no sin for either of them if the woman ransom herself. These are the limits imposed by Allah. Transgress them not. For whoso transgresseth Allah's limits, 
such are wrongdoers. And if he hath divorced her the third time, then she is not lawful unto him thereafter, until she hath wedded another husband. Then, if he the other husband divorce her, it is no sin for both of them that they come together again, if they consider that they are able to observe the limits of Allah. These are the limits of Allah. He manifested them for people who have knowledge. <laughs> When ye have divorced women and they have reached their term, then retain them in kindness or release them in kindness. Retain them not to their hurt so that ye transgress the limits. He who doth that hath wronged his soul. Make not the revelations of Allah a laughing stock by your behavior, but remember Allah's grace upon you and that which He hath revealed unto you of the scripture and of wisdom, whereby He doth exhort you. Observe your duty to Allah and know that Allah is aware of all things. <laughs> فلا تعضلوهن أن ينكحن أزواجهن إذا تراضوا بينهم بالمعروف ذلك يوعظ به من كان من And when ye have divorced women and they reach their term, place not difficulties in the way of their marrying their husbands, if it is agreed between them in kindness. This is an admonition for him among you who believeth in Allah and the last day. That is more virtuous for you and cleaner. Allah knoweth, ye know not. <laughs> وَلَا 
Mothers shall suckle their children for two whole years, that is for those who wish to complete the suckling. The duty of feeding and clothing, nursing mothers in a seemly manner is upon the father of the child. No one should be charged beyond his capacity. A mother should not be made to suffer because of her child, nor should he to whom the child is born be made to suffer because of his child. And on the father's heir is incumbent the like of that which was incumbent on the father. If they desire to wean the child by mutual consent and after consultation, it is no sin for them. And if ye wish to give your children out to nurse, it is no sin for you, provided that ye pay what is due from you in kindness. Observe your duty to Allah and know that Allah is seer of what ye do. <laughs> Such of you as die and leave behind them wives, they, the wives, shall wait, keeping themselves apart four months and ten days. And when they reach the term prescribed for them, then there's no sin for you in aught that they may do with themselves in decency. Allah is informed of what you do. Oh, 
ولا تعزم القدة النكاح حتى يبلغ الكتاب أجله واعلموا أن الله يعلم ما في أنفسكم فاحذروه واعلموا أن الله غفور حليم There's no sin for you in that which ye proclaim or hide in your minds concerning your troth with women. Allah knoweth that ye will remember them. But plight not your troth with women except by uttering a recognized form of words. And do not consummate the marriage until the term prescribed is run. Know that Allah knoweth what is in your minds, so beware of him. And know that Allah is forgiving clement la juna alaykum in qallaqtumun nisaa ma lam tamassuhun aw tafridu lahum faridah wa man ta'uhum It is no sin for you if ye divorce women while yet ye have not touched them, nor appointed unto them a portion. Provide for them the rich according to his means and the straightened according to his means, a fair provision. This is a bounden duty for those who do good. <laughs> If ye divorce them before ye have touched them, and ye have appointed unto them a portion, then pay the half of that which ye appointed, unless they, the women, agree to forego it, or he agreeth to forego it, in whose hand is the marriage tie. To forego is nearer to piety, and forget not kindness among yourselves. Allah is there of what ye do. Be guardians of your prayers and of the midmost prayer and stand up with devotion to Allah. If ye go in fear, then pray standing or on horseback. And when ye are again in safety, remember Allah, as he hath taught you that which heretofore ye knew not. <laughs>
In the case of those of you who are about to die and leave behind them wives, they should bequeath unto their wives a provision for the year without turning them out. But if they go out of their own accord, there's no sin for you in that which they do of themselves within their rights. Allah is mighty wise. <laughs> For divorced women, a provision in kindness, a duty for those who ward off evil. Thus Allah expoundeth unto you his revelations, so that ye may understand. Bethink thee, O Muhammad, of those of old who went forth from their habitations in their thousands, fearing death, and Allah said unto them, Die, and then he brought them back to life. Lo, Allah is a Lord of kindness to mankind, but most of mankind give not thanks. <laughs> Fight in the way of Allah and know that Allah is hearer, knower. Who is it that will lend unto Allah a goodly loan so that he may give it increase manifold? Allah straighteneth and enlargeth, unto him ye will return. إذ قالوا لنبي له مبعث لنا ملكا نقاتل في سبيل الله قال هل عسيتم قال هل عسيتم إن كتب عليكم القتال ألا تقاتلوا قالوا وما لنا قالوا وما لنا ألا نقاتل في سبيل الله وقد أخرجنا وقد أخرجنا من ديارنا وأبنائنا فلما كتب عليهم القتال تولوا إلا قليلا منهم والله عليم 
bethink thee of the leaders of the children of Israel after Moses, how they said unto a prophet whom they had, Set up for us a king, and we'll fight in Allah's way. He said, Would ye then refrain from fighting if fighting were prescribed for you? They said, Why should we not fight in Allah's way when we have been driven from our dwellings with our children? Yet, when fighting was prescribed for them, they turned away, all save a few of them. Allah is aware of evildoers. <laughs> Their Prophet said unto them, Lo, Allah hath raised up Saul to be a king for you. They said, How can he have kingdom over us when we are more deserving of the kingdom than he is, since he hath not been given wealth enough? He said, Lo, Allah hath chosen him above you and hath increased him abundantly in wisdom and stature. Allah bestoweth his sovereignty on whom he will. Allah is all-embracing, all-knowing. <laughs> And their prophet said unto them, Lo, the token of his kingdom is that there shall come unto you the ark, wherein is peace of reassurance from your Lord, and a remnant of that which the house of Moses and the house of Aaron left behind, the angels bearing it. Lo, Heron shall be a token for you if in truth ye are believers. <laughs> Thank you. 
And when Saul set out with the army, he said, Lo, Allah will try you by the ordeal of a river. Whosoever therefore drinketh thereof, he is not of me, and whosoever tasteth it not, he is of me, save him who taketh thereof in the hollow of his hand. But they drank thereof, all save a few of them. And after he had crossed the river, he and those who believed with him, they said, We have no power this day against Goliath and his hosts. But those who knew that they would meet their Lord exclaimed, How many a little company hath overcome a mighty host by Allah's leave? Allah is with the steadfast. <laughs> And when they went into the field against Goliath and his host, they said, Our Lord, bestow on us endurance, make our foothold sure, and give us help against the disbelieving folk. <laughs> So they routed them by Allah's leave, and David slew Goliath, and Allah gave him the kingdom and wisdom, and taught him of that which he willeth. And if Allah had not repelled some men by others, the earth would have been corrupted. But Allah is a Lord of kindness to his creatures. <laughs> These are the portents of Allah, which we recite unto thee, Muhammad, with truth. And lo, thou art of the number of our messengers. <laughs> Of those messengers, some of whom we have caused to excel others, and of whom there are some unto whom Allah spake, 
while some of them he exalted above others in degree. And we gave Jesus, son of Mary, clear proofs of Allah's sovereignty, and we supported him with the Holy Spirit. And if Allah had so willed it, those who followed after them would not have fought one with another after the clear proofs had come unto them. But they deferred, some of them believing and some disbelieving. And if Allah had so willed it, they would not have fought one with another. But Allah doeth what he will. <laughs> O ye who believe, spend of that wherewith we have provided you, ere a day come when there'll be no trafficking, nor friendship, nor intercession. The disbelievers, they are the wrongdoers. Allah, there's no God save Him, the Alive, the Eternal. Neither slumber nor sleep overtaketh Him. Unto him belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. Who is he that intercedeth with him save by his leave? He knoweth that which is in front of them and that which is behind them, while they encompass nothing of his knowledge save what he will. His throne included the heavens and the earth, and he is never weary of preserving them. He is the sublime, the tremendous. There is no compulsion in religion. The right direction is henceforth distinct from error. And he who rejecteth false deities and believeth in Allah hath grasped a firm handhold which will never break. Allah is hearer, knower.
Allah is the protecting friend of those who believe. He bringeth them out of darkness into light. As for those who disbelieve, their patrons are false deities. They bring them out of light into darkness. Such are rightful owners of the fire. They will abide therein. Alam tara ila alladhi hajja ibrahim fi rabbihi an atahu allahu al-mulka il qala ibrahim rabbi alladhi yuhyi wa yumi إذ قال إبراهيم ربي الذي يحيي ويميت قال أنا أحيي وأميت قال إبراهيم فإن الله يأتي بالشمس من المشرق قال إبراهيم فإن الله يأتي بالشمس من المشرق فأت بها من المغرب فبهت الذي كفر والله لا يهدي القوم الظالمين Bethink thee of him who had an argument with Abraham about his Lord because Allah had given him the kingdom? How when Abraham said, My Lord is he who giveth life and causeth death? He answered, I give life and cause death. Abraham said, Lo, Allah causeth the sun to rise in the east, so do thou cause it to come up from the west. Thus was the disbeliever abashed, and Allah guideth not wrongdoing folk. أو كالذي مر على قرية وهي خاوية على عروشها قال أنا يحيي هذه الله بعد موتها فأماته الله مئة فأماته الله مئة عام ثم بعثه قال كم لبثت قال لبثت يوما أو بعض يوم قال لبثت يوما أو بعض فانظر إلى طعامك وشرابك لم يتسنه وانظر إلى حمارك ولنجعلك آية للناس فلما تبين له قال أعلم أن الله على كل شيء قدير 
or bethink thee of the like of him who passing by a township which had fallen into utter ruin exclaimed how shall Allah give this township life after its death and Allah made him die a hundred years then brought him back to life he said how long hast thou tarried the man said I have tarried a day or part of a day he said nay but thou hast tarried for a hundred years just look at thy food and drink which have not rotted look at thine ass and that we may make thee a token unto mankind look at the bones how we adjust them and then cover them with flesh and when the matter became clear unto him he said I know now that Allah is able to do all things. وَإِذْ قَالَ إِبْرَاهِيمُ رَبِّ أَرِنِي كَيْفَ تُحْيِي الْمَوْتَى قَالَ أَوَلَمْ تُؤْمِنْ قَالَ بَلَا وَلَكِنْ لِيَطْمَ إِنَّ قَلْبِي قَالَ بَلَا And when Abraham said unto his Lord, My Lord, show me how thou givest life to the dead, he said, Dost thou not believe? Abraham said, Ye, but I ask, in order that my heart may be at ease. His Lord said, Take four of the birds and cause them to incline unto thee, then place a part of them on each hill, then call them, they'll come to thee in haste, and know that Allah is mighty wise. <laughs> The likeness of those who spend their wealth in Allah's way is as the likeness of a grain which groweth seven ears, in every ear a hundred grains. Allah giveth increase manifold to whom he will. Allah is all-embracing, all-knowing. <laughs> Those who spend their wealth for the cause of Allah and afterward make not reproach and injury to follow that which they have spent. Their reward is with their Lord and there shall no fear come upon them neither shall they grieve. <laughs> Wow. 
A kind word with forgiveness is better than alms giving followed by injury. Allah is absolute, clement. O ye who believe, render not vain your alms giving by reproach and injury, like him who spendeth his wealth only to be seen of men, and believeth not in Allah and the last day. His likeness is as the likeness of a rock whereon is dust of earth. A rainstorm smiteth it, leaving it smooth and bare. They have no control of aught of that which they have gained. Allah guideth not the disbelieving folk. <laughs> And the likeness of those who send their wealth in search of Allah's pleasure and for the strengthening of their souls is as the likeness of a garden on a height. The rainstorm smiteth it, and it bringeth forth its fruit twofold. And if the rainstorm smiteth not, then the Shah. Allah is seer of what ye do. <laughs> Would any of you like to have a garden of palm trees and wines with rivers flowing underneath it, with all kinds of fruit for him therein, 
and old age hath stricken him, and he hath feeble offspring, and a fiery whirlwind striketh it, and it is all consumed by fire. Thus Allah maketh plain his revelations unto you, in order that ye may give thought. <laughs> O ye who believe, spend of the good things which ye have earned, and of that which we bring forth from the earth for you, and seek not the bad with intent to spend thereof in charity, when ye would not take it for yourselves, save with disdain, and know that Allah is absolute owner of praise. الشيطان يعدكم الفقر ويأمركم بالفحشاء والله يعدكم مغفرة منه وفضلا والله واسع The devil promiseth you destitution and enjoineth on you lewdness, but Allah promiseth you forgiveness from himself with bounty. Allah is all-embracing, all-knowing. <laughs> He giveth wisdom unto whom he will, and he unto whom wisdom is given, he truly hath received abundant good, but none remember except men of understanding. Whatever alms ye spend, a while ye vow, lo, Allah knoweth it. Wrongdoers have no helpers. If ye publish your almsgiving, it is well, but if ye hide it and give it to the poor, it will be better for you, and will atone for some of your ill deeds. Allah is informed of what you do.
وما تنفقون إلا ابتغاء وجه الله وما تنفقوا من خير يوفى إليكم وأنتم لا تظلمون The guiding of them is not thy duty, O Muhammad, but Allah guideth whom he will. And whatsoever good thing ye spend, it is for yourselves, when ye spend not save in search of Allah's countenance. And whatsoever good thing ye spend, it will be repaid to you in full, and ye will not be wronged. <laughs> يستطيعون ضربا في الأرض يحسبهم الجاهل أغنياء من التعفف يحسبهم الجاهل أغنياء من التعفف تعرفهم بسيماهم لا يسألون الناس إلحافا وما تنفقوا من خير فإن الله به عليم Arms are for the poor who are straightened for the cause of Allah who cannot travel in the land for trade. The unthinking man accounted them wealthy because of their restraint. Thou shalt know them by their mark. They do not beg of men with importunity. And whatsoever good thing ye spend, lo, Allah knoweth it. <laughs> فَلَهُمْ أَجْرُهُمْ عِنْدَ رَبِّهِمْ وَلَا خَوْفٌ عَلَيْهِمْ وَلَا هُمْ يَحْزَنُونَ Those who spend their wealth by night and day, by stealth and openly, verily their reward is with their Lord, and there shall no fear come upon them, neither shall they grieve. الَّذِينَ يَأْكُلُونَ الرِّبَا لَا يَقُومُونَ إِلَّا كَمَا يَقُومُ الَّذِي يَتَخَبَّطُهُ الشَّيْطَانُ مِنَ الْمَسِ ذَلِكَ بِأَنَّهُمْ Those who swallow usury cannot rise up save as he ariseth whom the devil hath prostrated by his touch. That is because they say, trade is just like usury, whereas Allah permitteth trading and forbiddeth usury. He unto whom an admonition from his Lord cometh, and he refraineth in obedience thereto, he shall keep the profits of that which is past, and his affair henceforth is with Allah. 
As for him who returneth to usury, such are rightful owners of the fire. They will abide therein. <laughs> Allah hath blighted usury and made alms giving fruitful. Allah loveth not the impious and guilty. <laughs> Lo, those who believe and do good works and establish worship and pay the poor due, their reward is with their Lord, and there shall no fear come upon them, neither shall they grieve. Ye who believe, observe your duty to Allah and give up what remaineth due to you from usury, if ye are in truth believers. <laughs> And if ye do not, then be warned of war against you from Allah and his messenger. And if ye repent, then ye have your principle without interest. Wrong not, and ye shall not be wronged. <laughs> وَأَن تَصَدَّقُوا خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ إِن كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ And if the debtor is in straitened circumstances, then let there be postponement to the time of ease. And that ye remit the debt as almsgiving would be better for you if ye did but know. وَاتَّقُوا And guard yourselves against a day in which ye will be brought back to Allah. Then every soul will be paid in full that which it hath earned, and they will not be wronged. وَلْيَكْتُبْ بَيْنَكُمْ كَاتِبٌ بِالْعَدْلِ وَلَا يَأْبَ كَاتِبٌ أَنْ يَكْتُبَ كَمَا عَلَّمَهُ اللَّهُ فَلْيَكْتُبْ وَلْيُمْلِلِ الَّذِي عَلَيْهِ الْحَقُّ وَلْيَكْتُبْ Oh, 
وَاسْتَشْهِدُوا شَهِيدَيْنِ مِنْ رِجَالِكُمْ فَإِنْ لَمْ يَكُونَا رَجُلَيْنِ فَرَجُلُوا وَامْرَأَتَانِ مِمَّنْ تَرْضَوْنَ مِنَ الشُّهَدَاءِ تذكر إحداهما الأخرى ولا يأبى الشهداء إذا ما دعوا ولا تسأموا أن تكتبوه صغيرا أو كبيرا إلى ذلكم أقسط عند الله وأقوم للشهادة وأدنى ألا ترتابوا إلا أن تكون تجارة حاضرة فليس عليكم جناح ألا تكتبوها وأشهدوا إذا تبايعتم ولا يضار وكاتب ولا شهيد وَإِن تَفْعَلُوا فَإِنَّهُ فُسُوقٌ بِكُمْ وَاتَّقُوا اللَّهَ وَيُعَلِّمُكُمُ اللَّهُ وَاللَّهُ بِكُلِّ شَيْءٍ عَلِيمٌ O ye who believe When you contract a debt for a fixed term, record it in writing. Let a scribe record it in writing between you in terms of equity. No scribe should refuse to write as Allah hath taught him, so let him write. And let him who incurred the debt dictate, and let him observe his duty to Allah his Lord, and diminish naught thereof. But if he who oweth the debt is of low understanding, or weak, or unable himself to dictate, then let the guardian of his interests dictate in terms of equity, and call to witness from among your men two witnesses. And if two men be not at hand, then a man and two women, of such as ye approve as witnesses, so that if the one erreth through forgetfulness, the other will remember. And the witnesses must not refuse when they are summoned. Be not averse to writing down the contract, whether it be small or great, with record of the term thereof. That is more equitable in the sight of Allah and more sure for testimony and the best way of avoiding doubt between you, save only in the case when it is actual merchandise which ye transfer among yourselves from hand to hand. In that case, it is no sin for you if ye write it not. And have witnesses when ye sell one to another and let no harm be done to scribe or witness. If ye do harm to them, lo, it is a sin in you. Observe your duty to Allah. Allah is teaching you, and Allah is knower of all things. <laughs> ف 
فإن أمن بعضكم بعضا فليؤدي الذي ائتمن أمانته وليتق الله ربه ولا تكتم الشهادة ومن يكتمها فإنه آثم قلبه والله بما تعملون عليم If ye be on a journey and cannot find a scribe, then a pledge in hand shall suffice. And if one of you entrusteth to another, let him who is trusted deliver up that which is entrusted to him according to the pact between them, and let him observe his duty to Allah his Lord. Hide not testimony. He who hideth it, verily his heart is sinful. Allah is aware of what you do. <laughs> Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. And whether ye make known what is in your minds or hide it, Allah will bring you to account for it. He will forgive whom he will and he will punish whom he will. Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> وقالوا سمعنا وأطعنا غفرانك ربنا وإليك المصير The messenger believeth in that which hath been revealed unto him from his Lord, and so do the believers. Each one believeth in Allah and his angels and his scriptures and his messengers. We make no distinction between any of his messengers, and they say, We hear and we obey. Grant us thy forgiveness, our Lord. Unto thee is the journeying. <laughs> رَبَّنَا لَا تُؤَاخِذْنَا إِن نَّسِينَا أَوْ أَخْطَأْنَا رَبَّنَا وَلَا تَحْمِلْ عَلَيْنَا إِصْرًا كَمَا حَمَلْتَهُ رَبَّنَا وَلَا تُحَمِّلْنَا مَا لَا طَاقَةَ لَنَا بِهِ وَأَعْفُ عَنَّا وَاغْفِرْ لَنَا وَارْحَمْنَا أَنْتَ مَوْلَانَا فَانْصُرْنَا عَلَى الْقَوْمِ الْكَافِرِينَ Allah tasketh not a soul beyond its scope, 
for it is only that which it hath earned, and against it only that which it hath deserved. Our Lord, condemn us not if we forget or miss the mark. Our Lord, lay not on us such a burden as thou didst lay on those before us. Our Lord, impose not on us that which we have not the strength to bear. Pardon us, absolve us, and have mercy on us. Thou, our protector, and give us victory over the disbelieving folk. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Alif Lam Meem Allah, there's no God save Him, the Alive, the Eternal. He hath revealed unto thee, Muhammad, the scripture with truth, confirming that which was revealed before it, even as he revealed the Torah and the Gospel. A four time for a guidance to mankind and hath revealed the criterion of right and wrong. Lo, those who disbelieve the revelations of Allah, theirs will be a heavy doom. Allah is mighty, able to require the wrong. <laughs> Lo, nothing in the earth or in the heavens is hidden from Allah. He it is who fashioneth you in the wombs as pleaseth him. There's no God save him, the Almighty, the wise. He it is who hath revealed unto thee, Muhammad, the scripture wherein are clear revelations. They are the substance of the book and others which are allegorical, but those in whose hearts is doubt pursue forsooth. 
that which is allegorical, seeking to cause dissension by seeking to explain it. None knoweth its explanation save Allah, and those who are of sound instruction say, We believe therein, the whole is from our Lord, but only men of understanding really heed. <laughs> Our Lord, cause not our hearts to stray after Thou hast guided us, and bestow upon us mercy from Thy presence. Lo, Thou, only Thou art the bestower. <laughs> Our Lord, it is Thou who gatherest mankind together to a day of which there is no doubt. Lo, Allah faileth not to keep the tryst. <laughs> لن تغني عنهم أموالهم ولا أولادهم من الله شيئا وأولئك هم وقود النار On that day neither the riches nor the progeny of those who disbelieve will ought avail them with Allah. They will be fuel for fire. Like Pharaoh spoke, and those who were before them, they disbelieved our revelations, and so Allah sees them for their sins, and Allah is severe in punishment. <laughs> Say, O Muhammad, unto those who disbelieve, ye shall be overcome and gathered unto hell, an evil resting place. <laughs> There was a token for you in two hosts which met, one army fighting in the way of Allah and another disbelieving, whom they saw as twice their number, clearly with their very eyes. Thus Allah strengtheneth with his succor whom he will. Lo, herein verily is a lesson for those who have eyes. <laughs> والأنعام والحرف 
ذلك متاع الحياة الدنيا والله عنده حسن المآب Beautified for mankind is love of the joys that come from women and offspring and stored up heaps of gold and silver and horses branded with their mark and cattle and land. That is comfort of the life of the world. Allah with him is a more excellent abode. <laughs> Say, shall I inform you of something better than that? For those who keep from evil, with their Lord are gardens underneath which rivers flow, wherein they will abide, and pure companions, and contentment from Allah. Allah is seer of his bondmen. <laughs> Those who say, Our Lord, lo, we believe, so forgive us our sins and guard us from the punishment of fire. The steadfast and the truthful and the obedient, those who spend and hoard not, those who pray for pardon in the watches of the night. <laughs> Allah himself is witness that there is no God save him and the angels and the men of learning too are witness. Maintaining his creation and justice, there is no God save him, the Almighty, the wise. <laughs> Lo, religion with Allah is the surrender to His will and guidance. Those who formerly received the scripture deferred only after knowledge came unto them through transgression among themselves. Whoso disbelieveth the revelations of Allah will find that, lo, Allah is swift at reckoning.
فَإِنْ أَسْلَمُوا فَقَدِ اهْتَدَوْا وَإِنْ تَوَلَّوْا فَإِنَّمَا عَلَيْكَ الْبَلَاغُ وَاللَّهُ بَصِيرٌ بِالْعِبَادِ And if they argue with thee, O Muhammad, say, I have surrendered my purpose to Allah, and so have those who follow me. And say unto those who have received the scripture, and those who read not, Have ye too surrendered? If they surrender, then truly they are rightly guided, and if they turn away, then it is thy duty only to convey the message unto them. Allah is seer of his bondman. <laughs> Lo, those who disbelieve the revelations of Allah and slay the prophets wrongfully and slay those of mankind who enjoin equity promise them a painful doom. Those are they whose works have failed in the world and the hereafter and they have no helpers. Hast thou not seen how those who have received a portion of the scripture of Allah in their disputes that it may judge between them, then a faction of them turn away, being opposed to it? <laughs> That is because, they say, the fire will not touch us, save for a certain number of days. That which they used to invent hath deceived them regarding their religion. <laughs> How will it be with them when we have brought them all together to a day of which there's no doubt, when every soul will be paid in full what it hath earned, and they will not be wronged? <laughs> Say, O Allah, 
owner of sovereignty. Thou givest sovereignty unto whom thou wilt, and thou withdrawest sovereignty from whom thou wilt. Thou exaltest whom thou wilt, and thou abasest whom thou wilt. In thy hand is the good. Lo, thou art able to do all things. <laughs> وتخرج الحي من الميت وتخرج الميت من الحي وترزق من تشاء بغير حساب Thou causest the night to pass into the day and thou causest the day to pass into the night and thou bringest forth the living from the dead and thou bringest forth the dead from the living and thou givest sustenance to whom thou choosest without stint <laughs> Let not the believers take disbelievers for their friends in preference to believers. Whoso doth that hath no connection with Allah unless it be that ye but guard yourselves against them, taking as it were security. Allah biddeth you beware only of himself, and to Allah is the journeying. <laughs> Say, O Muhammad, whether ye hide that which is in your breasts or reveal it, Allah knoweth it. He knoweth that which is in the heavens and that which is in the earth. And Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> On the day when every soul will find itself confronted with all that it hath done of good and all that it hath done of evil, every soul will long that there might be a mighty space of distance between it and that evil. Allah biddeth you beware of him, and Allah is full of pity for his bondman. Say, O 
Say, O Muhammad, to mankind, if ye love Allah, follow me. Allah will love you and forgive you your sins. Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> Say, Obey Allah and the Messenger. But if they turn away, lo, Allah loveth not the disbelievers in His guidance. <laughs> Lo, Allah preferred Adam and Noah and the family of Abraham and the family of Imran above all his creatures. <laughs> they were descendants one of another. Allah is Hera, Noah. Remember when the wife of Imran said, My Lord, I have vowed unto thee that which is in my belly as a consecrated offering. Accept it from me. Lo, thou, only thou art the hearer, the knower. <laughs> And when she was delivered, she said, My Lord, lo, I am delivered of a female. Allah knew best of what she was delivered. The male is not as the female. And lo, I have named her Mary. And lo, I crave thy protection for her and for her offspring from Satan, the outcast. <laughs> And her Lord accepted her with full acceptance and vouchsafed to her a goodly growth and made Zachariah her guardian. When Zachariah went into the sanctuary where she was, he found that she had food. He said, O Mary, 
Whence cometh unto thee this food? She answered, It is from Allah. Allah giveth without stint to whom he will. Then Zachariah prayed unto his Lord and said, My Lord, bestow upon me of thy bounty goodly offspring. Lo, thou art the hearer of prayer. And the angels called to him as he stood praying in the sanctuary. Allah giveth thee glad tidings of a son whose name is John, who cometh to confirm a word from Allah, lordly, chaste, a prophet of the righteous. <laughs> He said, My Lord, how can I have a son when age hath overtaken me already and my wife is barren? The angel answered, So it will be. Allah doth what he will. <laughs> He said, My Lord, appoint a token for me. The angel said, The token unto thee shall be that thou shalt not speak unto mankind three days except by signs. Remember thy Lord much and praise him in the early hours of night and morning. <laughs> And when the angel said, O Mary, lo, Allah hath chosen thee and made thee pure, and hath preferred thee above all the women of creation. O Mary, be obedient to thy Lord, prostrate thyself, and bow with those who bow in worship. This is of the tidings of things hidden. We reveal it unto thee, Muhammad. 
thou wast not present with them when they threw their pens to know which of them should be the guardian of Mary, nor wast thou present with them when they quarreled thereupon. <laughs> اسمه المسيح عيسى بن مريم وجيها في الدنيا والآخرة ومن المقربين. And remember when the angel said, O oh Mary, lo, Allah giveth thee glad tidings of a word from him whose name is the Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary illustrious in the world and the hereafter, and one of those brought near unto Allah. He will speak unto mankind in his cradle and in his manhood, and he is of the righteous. She said, My Lord, how can I have a child when no mortal hath touched me? He said, So it will be. Allah createth what he will. If he decreeth a thing, he saith unto it only, Be, and it is. <laughs> And he will teach him the scripture and wisdom and the Torah and the gospel. and will make him a messenger unto the children of Israel, saying, Lo, I come unto you with a sign from your Lord. Lo, I fashion for you out of clay the likeness of a bird, and I breathe into it, and it is a bird, by Allah's leave. I heal him who was born blind, and the leper, and I raise the dead by Allah's leave. And I announce unto you what ye eat, and what ye store up in your houses. 
Lo, herein verily is important for you if ye are to be believers. <laughs> And I come confirming that which was before me of the Torah, and to make lawful some of that which was forbidden unto you. I come unto you with a sign from your Lord, so keep your duty to Allah and obey me. Lo, Allah is my Lord and your Lord, so worship Him, that is the straight path. But when Jesus became conscious of their disbelief, he cried, Who will be my helpers in the cause of Allah? The disciples said, We will be Allah's helpers. We believe in Allah and bear thou witness that we have surrendered unto him. <laughs> Our Lord, we believe in that which Thou hast revealed, and we follow him whom Thou hast sent. Enroll us among those who witness to the truth. <laughs> And they, the disbelievers, schemed, and Allah schemed against them, and Allah is the best of schemers. <laughs> And remember, when Allah said, O Jesus, lo, I am gathering thee and causing thee to ascend unto me, and am cleansing thee of those who disbelieve, and am setting those who follow thee above those who disbelieve until the day of resurrection. Then unto me ye will all return, and I shall judge between you 
as to that wherein ye used to differ. فأعذبهم عذابا شديدا في الدنيا والآخرة وما لهم من ناصرين. As for those who disbelieve, I shall chastise them with a heavy chastisement in the world and the hereafter, and they will have no helpers. And as for those who believe and do good works, he will pay them their wages in full. Allah loveth not wrongdoers. This which we recite unto thee is a revelation and a wise reminder. Lo, the likeness of Jesus with Allah is as the likeness of Adam. He created him of dust, then he said unto him, Be, and he is. This is the truth from thy Lord, O Muhammad, so be not thou of those who waver. And whoso disputeth with thee concerning him after the knowledge which hath come unto thee, say unto him, Come, we will summon our sons and your sons, and our women and your women, and ourselves and yourselves, then we'll pray humbly to our Lord and solemnly invoke the curse of Allah upon those who lie. <laughs> Lo, this verily is the true narrative. There's no God save Allah. And lo, Allah, He verily is the mighty, the wise. And if they turn away, then lo, Allah is aware of who are the corruptors. Thank you. 
به شيئا ألا نعبد إلا الله ولا نشرك به شيئا ولا يتخذ بعضنا بعضا أربابا من دون Say, O people of the scripture, come to an agreement between us and you that we shall worship none but Allah and that we shall ascribe no partner unto him and that none of us shall take others for lords beside Allah. And if they turn away, then say, bear witness that we are they who have surrendered unto him. <laughs> O people of the scripture, why will ye argue about Abraham when the Torah and the gospel were not revealed till after him? Have ye then no sins? Lo, ye are those who argue about that whereof ye have some knowledge. Why then argue ye concerning that whereof ye have no knowledge? Allah knoweth, ye know not. Abraham was not a Jew nor yet a Christian, but he was an upright man who had surrendered to Allah, and he was not of the idolaters. <laughs> Lo, those of mankind who have the best claim to Abraham are those who followed him, and this prophet, and those who believe with him, and Allah is the protecting friend of the believers. <laughs> A party of the people of the scripture long to make you go astray, and they make none to go astray except themselves, but they perceive not. O people of the scripture, why disbelieve ye in the revelations of Allah when ye yourselves bear witness to their truth? Yeah, 
O people of the scripture, why confound ye truth with falsehood and knowingly conceal the truth? And a party of the people of the scripture say, Believe in that which hath been revealed unto those who believe at the opening of the day, and disbelieve at the end thereof, in order that they may return. <laughs> And believe not save in one who followeth your religion. Say, O Muhammad, lo, the guidance is Allah's guidance. That anyone is given the like of that which was given unto you, or that they may argue with you in the presence of their Lord. Say, O Muhammad, lo, the bounty is in Allah's hand. He bestoweth it on whom he will. Allah is all-embracing, all-knowing. <laughs> He selecteth for his mercy whom he will. Allah is of infinite bounty. Among the people of the scripture there is he who if thou trust him with a weight of treasure will return it to thee. And among them there is he who if thou trust him with a piece of gold will not return it to thee unless thou keep standing over him. That is because they say we have no duty to the Gentiles. They speak a lie concerning Allah knowingly. <laughs> Nay, but the chosen of Allah is He who fulfilleth His pledge and wardeth off evil. For lo, Allah loveth those who ward off evil. <laughs> Oh, 
Lo, those who purchase a small gain at the cost of Allah's covenant and their oaths, they have no portion in the hereafter. Allah will neither speak to them nor look upon them on the day of resurrection, nor will he make them grow. Theirs will be a painful doom. <laughs> And lo, there's a party of them who distort the scripture with their tongues, that ye may think that what they say is from the scripture, when it is not from the scripture. And they say, it is from Allah, when it is not from Allah. And they speak a lie concerning Allah knowingly. <laughs> It is not possible for any human being unto whom Allah had given the scripture and wisdom and the prophethood that he should afterwards have said unto mankind, Be slaves of me instead of Allah. But what he said was, Be ye faithful servants of the Lord by virtue of your constant teaching of the scripture and of your constant study thereof. <laughs> And he commanded you not that ye should take the angels and the prophets for lords. Would he command you to disbelieve after ye had surrendered to Allah? <laughs> Oh, 
When Allah made his covenant with the prophets, he said, Behold that which I have given you of the scripture and knowledge, and afterward there will come unto you a messenger, confirming that which ye possess. Ye shall believe in him, and ye shall help him. He said, Do ye agree, and will ye take up my burden which I lay upon you in this matter? They answered, We agree. He said, Then bear ye witness, I will be a witness with you. <laughs> Then whosoever after this shall turn away, they will be miscreants. Seek they other than the religion of Allah when unto him submitteth whosoever is in the heavens and the earth, willingly or unwillingly, and unto him they will be returned. <laughs> Say, O Muhammad, we believe in Allah and that which is revealed unto us and that which was revealed unto Abraham and Ishmael and Isaac and Jacob and the tribes and that which was vouchsafed unto Moses and Jesus and the prophets from their Lord. We make no distinction between any of them and unto him we have surrendered. <laughs> And whoso seeketh as religion other than the surrender to Allah, it will not be accepted from him, and he will be a loser in the hereafter. <laughs> How shall Allah guide a people who disbelieved after their belief and after they bore witness that the Messenger is true and after clear proofs of Allah's sovereignty had come unto them? And Allah guided not wrongdoing folk. <laughs> As for such, their guerdon is that on them rests the curse of Allah and of angels and of men combined. <laughs> Those 
They will abide therein. Their doom will not be lightened, neither will they be reprieved. <laughs> Save those who afterward repent and do right. Lo, Allah is forgiving, merciful. Lo, those who disbelieve after their profession of belief and afterward grow violent in disbelief, their repentance will not be accepted, and such are those who are astray. <laughs> Lo, those who disbelieve and die in disbelief, the whole earth full of gold would not be accepted from such an one if it were offered as a ransom for his soul. Theirs will be a painful doom and they will have no helpers. <laughs> not attain unto piety until ye spend of that which ye love, and whatsoever ye spend, Allah is aware thereof. <laughs> All food was lawful unto the children of Israel, save that which Israel forbade himself in days before the Torah was revealed. Say, produce the Torah and read it unto us if ye are truthful. <laughs> Whoever shall invent a falsehood after that concerning Allah, such will be wrongdoers. <laughs> Say, Allah speaketh truth, so follow the religion of Abraham the upright. He was not of the idolaters. <laughs> Lo, 
The first sanctuary appointed for mankind was that at Becca, a blessed place, a guidance to the peoples. <laughs> Wherein are plain memorials of Allah's guidance, the place where Abraham stood up to pray, and whosoever entereth it is safe. And pilgrimage to the house is a duty unto Allah for mankind, for him who can find a way thither. As for him who disbelieveth, let him know that, lo, Allah is independent of all creatures. <laughs> Say, O people of the scripture, why disbelieve ye in the revelations of Allah when Allah himself is witness of what ye do? <laughs> Say, O people of the scripture, why drive ye back believers from the way of Allah, seeking to make it crooked, when ye are witnesses to Allah's guidance? Allah is not unaware of what ye do. who believe if ye obey a party of those who have received the scripture they will make you disbelievers after your belief <laughs> How can you disbelieve when it is ye unto whom Allah's revelations are recited and his messenger is in your midst? He who holdeth fast to Allah, he indeed is guided unto a right path. Ya O ye who believe, observe your duty to Allah with right observance, and die not save as those who have surrendered unto Him. Thank 
فَأَلَّفَ بَيْنَ قُلُوبِكُمْ فَأَصْبَحْتُمْ بِنِعْمَتِهِ إِخْوَانًا فَأَصْبَحْتُمْ بِنِعْمَتِهِ إِخْوَانًا وَكُنْتُمْ عَلَى شَفَا حُفْرَةٍ مِّنَ النَّارِ فَأَنْقَذَكُمْ مِنْهَا كَذَلِكَ يُبَيِّنُ اللَّهُ لَكُمْ And hold fast all of you together to the cable of Allah, and do not separate. And remember Allah's favor unto you, how ye were enemies and he made friendship between your hearts, so that ye became as brothers by his grace. And how ye were upon the brink of an abyss of fire, and he did save you from it. Thus Allah maketh clear his revelations unto you, that haply ye may be guided. وَاتَّقُمْ مِنْكُمْ أُمَّةٌ يَدْعُونَ إِلَى الْخَيْرِ وَيَأْمُرُونَ بِالْمَعْرُوفِ وَيَنْهَوْنَ عَنِ الْمُنْكَرِ وَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْمُفْلِحُونَ And there may spring from you a nation who invite to goodness and enjoin right conduct and forbid indecency. Such are they who are successful. <laughs> And be ye not as those who separated and disputed after the clear proofs had come unto them. For such there's an awful doom. On the day when some faces will be whitened and some faces will be blackened, and as for those whose faces have been blackened, it will be said unto them, Disbelieved ye after your profession of belief? Then taste the punishment for that ye disbelieved. <laughs> And as for those whose faces have been whitened, lo, in the mercy of Allah, they dwell forever. These are revelations of Allah. We recite them unto thee in truth. Allah willeth no injustice to his creatures. Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. And unto Allah all things are returned. And 
Ye are the best community that hath been raised up for mankind. Ye enjoin right conduct and forbid indecency, and ye believe in Allah. And if the people of the scripture had believed, it had been better for them. Some of them are believers, but most of them are evil livers. <laughs> They will not harm you save a trifling hurt, and if they fight against you, they will turn and flee, and afterward they will not be helped. Ignominy shall be their portion wheresoever they are found, save where they grasp a rope from Allah and a rope from men. They have incurred anger from their Lord, and wretchedness is laid upon them. That is because they used to disbelieve the revelations of Allah and slew the prophets wrongfully. That is because they were rebellious and used to transgress. <laughs> They are not all alike. Of the people of the scripture, there's a staunch community who recite the revelations of Allah in the night season, falling prostrate before him. <laughs> They believe in Allah and the last day and enjoin right conduct and forbid indecency and why one with another in good works. These are of the righteous. <laughs> And whatever good they do, they will not be denied the meat thereof. Allah is aware of those who ward off evil. <laughs> Lo, 
the riches and the progeny of those who disbelieve will not avail them aught against Allah, and such are rightful owners of the fire, they will abide therein. <laughs> The likeness of that which they spend in this life of the world is as the likeness of a biting, icy wind which smiteth the harvest of a people who have wronged themselves and devastated it. Allah wronged them not, but they did wrong themselves. O ye who believe, take not for intimates others than your own folk, who would spare no pains to ruin you. They love to hamper you. Hatred is revealed by the utterance of their mouths, but that which their breasts hide is greater. We have made plain for you the revelations, if ye will understand. <laughs> وَإِذَا لَقُوكُمْ قَالُوا آمَنَّا وَإِذَا خَلَوْا عَضُّوا عَلَيْكُمُ الْأَنَامِلَ مِنَ الْغَيْضِ قُلْ مُوتُوا بِغَيْضِكُمْ Lo, ye are those who love them, though they love you not, and ye believe in all the scripture. When they fall in with you, they say, We believe, but when they go apart, they bite their fingertips at you for rage. Say, Perish in your rage. Lo, Allah is aware of what is hidden in your breasts. <laughs> If a lucky chance befall you, it is evil unto them, and if disaster strike you, they rejoice thereat. But if you persevere and keep from evil, their guile will never harm you. Lo, Allah is surrounding what they do. <laughs> And when thou settest forth at daybreak from thy housefolk to assign to the believers their positions for the battle, Allah was Hera, Noah. <laughs> (laughs) 
When two parties of you almost fell away and Allah was their protecting friend, in Allah let believers put their trust. Allah had already given you the victory at Badr when ye were contemptible. So observe your duty to Allah in order that ye may be thankful. <laughs> And when thou didst say unto the believers, Is it not sufficient for you that your Lord should support you with three thousand angels sent down to your help? <laughs> Nay, but if ye persevere and keep from evil and the enemy attack you suddenly, your Lord will help you with five thousand angels sweeping on. <laughs> Allah ordained this only as a message of good cheer for you and that thereby your hearts might be at rest. Victory cometh only from Allah, the mighty, the wise. <laughs> that he may cut off a part of those who disbelieve or overwhelm them so that they retire frustrated. <laughs> It is no concern at all of the Muhammad whether he relent toward them or punish them, for they are evildoers. <laughs> Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. He forgiveth whom he will and punisheth whom he will. Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> O ye who believe, devour not usury, doubling and quadrupling the sum lent. Observe your duty to Allah, that ye may be successful. <laughs> and ward off from yourselves the fire prepared for disbelievers. And obey Allah 
and the messenger that ye may find mercy. And why one with another for forgiveness from your Lord and for a paradise as wide as are the heavens and the earth, prepared for those who ward off evil. Those who spend of that which Allah hath given them in ease and in adversity, those who control their wrath and are forgiving toward mankind, Allah loveth the good. <laughs> And those who when they do an evil thing or wrong themselves, remember Allah and implore forgiveness for their sins. Who forgiveth sins save Allah only, and will not knowingly repeat the wrong they did. <laughs> The reward of such will be forgiveness from their Lord and gardens underneath which rivers flow wherein they will abide forever. A bountiful reward for workers. Systems have passed away before you. Do but travel in the land and see the nature of the consequence for those who did deny the messengers. <laughs> This is a declaration for mankind, a guidance and an admonition unto those who ward off evil. Faint not nor grieve. For ye will overcome them if ye are indeed believers. <laughs>
If ye have received a blow, the disbelieving people have received a blow, the light thereof. These are only the vicissitudes which we cause to follow one another for mankind, to the end that Allah may know those who believe and may choose witnesses from among you. And Allah loveth not wrongdoers. <laughs> And that Allah may prove those who believe and may blight the disbelievers. Deem ye that ye would enter paradise while yet Allah knoweth not those of you who really strive, nor knoweth those of you who are steadfast? <laughs> Verily, ye used to wish for death before ye met it in the field. Now ye have seen it with your eyes. <laughs> Muhammad is but a messenger, messengers the like of whom have passed away before him. Will it be that when he dieth or is slain, ye will turn back on your heels? He who turneth back doth no hurt to Allah, and Allah will reward the thankful. No soul can ever die except by Allah's leave and at a term appointed. Whoso desireth the reward of the world, we bestow on him thereof, and whoso desireth the reward of the hereafter, we bestow on him thereof. We shall reward the thankful. <laughs> And with how many a prophet have there been a number of devoted men who fought beside him? They quailed not for aught that befell them in the way of Allah, nor did they weaken, nor were they brought low. Allah loveth the steadfast. <laughs> I'm 
Their cry was only that they said, Our Lord, forgive us for our sins and wasted efforts. Make our foothold sure and give us victory over the disbelieving folk. So Allah gave them the reward of the world and the good reward of the hereafter. Allah loveth those whose deeds are good. Ya ayyuhal ladheena amanu in tuti'u ladheena kafaru yardukum ala a'qabikum fatanqalibu khasirin O ye who believe if ye obey those who disbelieve, they will make you turn back on your heels, and ye turn back as losers. But Allah is your protector, and He is the best of helpers. We shall cast terror into the hearts of those who disbelieve because they ascribe unto Allah partners for which no warrant hath been revealed. Their habitation is the fire and hapless the abode of the wrongdoers. Allah verily made good his promise unto you when ye routed them by his leave until the moment when your courage failed you and ye disagreed about the order and ye disobeyed after he had shown you that for which ye long. Some of you desired the world and some of you desired the hereafter. Therefore he made you flee from them that he might try you. Yet now he hath forgiven you. Allah is the Lord of kindness to believers. <laughs> ف 
أثابكم غما بغم فأثابكم غم والله خبير بما تعملون When ye climbed the hill and paid no heed to anyone while the messenger in your rear was calling you to fight, therefore he rewarded you grief for his grief, that he might teach you not to sorrow either for that which he missed or for that which befell you. Allah is informed of what ye do. Um, Then after grief he sent down security for you. As slumber did it overcome a party of you, while the other party who were anxious on their own account thought wrongly of Allah, the thought of ignorance. They said, Have we any part in the cause? Say, O Muhammad, the cause belongeth wholly to Allah. They hide within themselves a thought which they reveal not unto thee, saying, Had we had any part in the cause, we should not have been slain here. Say, even though ye had been in your houses, those appointed to be slain would have gone forth to the places where they were to lie. All this hath been in order that Allah might try what is in your breasts and prove what is in your hearts. Allah is aware of what is hidden in the breasts of men. <laughs> Shine 
Lo, those of you who turn back on the day when the two hosts met, Satan alone it was who caused them to backslide because of some of that which they have earned. Now Allah hath forgiven them. Lo, Allah is forgiving, clement. Yeah. O ye who believe, be not as those who disbelieved and said of their brethren who went abroad in the land over fighting in the field. If they had been here with us, they would not have died or been killed that Allah may make it anguish in their hearts. Allah giveth life and causeth death, and Allah is seer of what ye do. <laughs> And what though ye be slain in Allah's way or die therein? Surely pardon from Allah and mercy are better than all that they amass. <laughs> What though ye be slain or die when unto Allah ye are gathered? It was by the mercy of Allah that thou wast lenient with them, O Muhammad. For if thou hadst been stern and fierce of heart, they would have dispersed from round about thee. So pardon them and ask forgiveness for them and consult with them upon the conduct of affairs. And when thou art resolved, then put thy trust in Allah. Lo, Allah loveth those who put their trust in Him. <laughs> If Allah is your helper, none can overcome you, 
and if he withdraw his help from you, who is there who can help you? In Allah, let believers put their trust. <laughs> It is not for any prophet to deceive mankind. Whoso deceiveth will bring his deceit with him on the day of resurrection. Then every soul will be paid in full what it hath earned, and they will not be wronged. <laughs> Is one who followed the pleasure of Allah as one who hath earned condemnation from Allah, whose habitation is the fire, a hapless journey's end. <laughs> There are degrees of grace and reprobation with Allah, and Allah is seer of what you do. Allah verily hath shown grace to the believers by sending unto them a messenger of their own who reciteth unto them his revelations and causeth them to grow and teacheth them the scripture and wisdom although before he came to them they were in flagrant error. <laughs> And was it so when a disaster smote you, though ye had smitten them with a disaster twice as great, that ye said, How is this? Say unto them, O Muhammad, it is from yourselves. Lo, Allah is able to do all things. <laughs> That which befell you on the day when the two armies met was by permission of Allah that he might know the true believers. <laughs> Yeah. 
And that he might know the hypocrites unto whom it was said, Come, fight in the way of Allah, or defend yourselves. They answered, If we knew aught of fighting, we would follow you. On that day, they were nearer disbelief than faith. They utter with their mouths a thing which is not in their hearts. Allah is best aware of what they hide. <laughs> Those who while they sat at home said of their brethren who were fighting for the cause of Allah, if they had been guided by us, they would not have been slain. Say unto them, O Muhammad, then a word death from yourselves if ye are truthful. Think not of those who are slain in the way of Allah as dead. Nay, they are living. With their Lord they have provision. Jubilant are they because of that which Allah hath bestowed upon them of his bounty, rejoicing for the sake of those who have not joined them but are left behind, that there shall no fear come upon them, neither shall they grieve. <laughs> They rejoice because of favor from Allah and kindness, and that Allah wasteth not the wage of the believers. <laughs> As for those who heard the call of Allah and His Messenger after the harm befell them in the fight, for such of them as do right and ward of evil, there's great reward. <laughs> Those unto whom men said, Lo, the people have gathered against you, therefore fear them. The threat of danger but increased the faith of them, and they cried, Allah is sufficient for us. Most excellent is he in whom we trust. <laughs> Allah. 
So they returned with grace and favor from Allah, and no harm touched them. They followed the good pleasure of Allah, and Allah is of infinite bounty. It is only the devil who would make men fear his partisans. Fear them not, fear me, if ye are true believers. <laughs> Let not their conduct grieve thee who run easily to disbelieve, for lo, they injure Allah not at all. It is Allah's will to assign them no portion in the hereafter. And theirs will be an awful doom. <laughs> Those who purchase disbelief at the price of faith harm Allah not at all. But theirs will be a painful doom. And let not those who disbelieve imagine that the rain we give them bodeth good unto their souls. We only give them rain that they may grow in sinfulness, and theirs will be a shameful doom. <laughs> It is not the purpose of Allah to leave you in your present state till he shall separate the wicked from the good. And it is not the purpose of Allah to let you know the unseen, but Allah chooseth of his messengers whom he will to receive knowledge thereof. So believe in Allah and his messengers. If ye believe and ward off evil, yours will be a vast reward. <laughs> Bell 
And let not those who hoard up that which Allah hath bestowed upon them of his bounty think that it is better for them, nay, it is worse for them. That which they hoard will be their collar on the day of resurrection. Allah's is the heritage of the heavens and the earth, and Allah is informed of what ye do. Verily, Allah heard the saying of those who said, when asked for contributions to the war, Allah forsooth is poor and we are rich. We shall record their saying with their slaying of the prophets wrongfully, and we shall say, Taste ye the punishment of burning. <laughs> This is on account of that which your own hands have sent before you to the judgment. Allah is no oppressor of his bondmen. The same are those who say, Lo, Allah hath charged us that we believe not in any messenger until he bring us an offering, which fire from heaven shall devour. Say unto them, O Muhammad, messengers came unto you before me with miracles and with that very miracle which ye describe. Why then did you slay them? Answer that if ye are truthful. <laughs> And if they deny thee, even so did they deny messengers who were before thee, who came with miracles and with the Psalms and with the scripture giving light. Every soul will taste of death and ye will be paid on the day of resurrection only that which ye have fairly earned. Whoso is removed from the fire and is made to enter paradise, he indeed is triumphant. The life of this world is but comfort of illusion. 
فِي أَمْوَالِكُمْ وَأَنفُسِكُمْ وَلَا تَسْمَعُونَ مِنَ الَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابَ مِنْ قَبْلِكُمْ وَلَا تَسْمَعُونَ مِنَ الَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابَ مِنْ قَبْلِكُمْ وَمِنَ الَّذِينَ أَشْرَكُوا أَذًا كَثِيرًا وَإِنْ تَصْبِرُوا وَتَتَّقُوا تَقُ فَإِنَّ ذَلِكَ مِنْ عَزْمِ الْأُمُورِ Assuredly ye will be tried in your property and in your persons and ye will hear much wrong from those who were given the scripture before you and from the idolaters but if ye persevere and ward off evil then that is of the steadfast heart of things وَإِذْ أَخَذَ اللَّهُ مِيثَاقَ الَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابَ لَتُبَيِّنُنَّهُ لِلنَّاسِ وَلَا تَكْتُمُونَهُ فَنَبَذُوهُ وَرَاءَ ظُهُورِهِمْ فَنَبَذُوهُ وَرَاءَ And remember when Allah laid a charge on those who had received the scripture, he said, Ye are to expound it to mankind and not to hide it. But they flung it behind their backs and bought thereby a little gain. Verily, evil is that which they have gained thereby. Think not that those who exult in what they have given and love to be praised for what they have not done. Think not, they are in safety from the doom. A painful doom is theirs. And to Allah belongeth the sovereignty of the heavens and the earth. Allah is able to do all things. Lo, in the creation of the heavens and the earth, and in the difference of night and day are tokens of His sovereignty for men of understanding.
such as remember Allah standing, sitting and reclining, and consider the creation of the heavens and the earth, and say, Our Lord, Thou createdst not this in vain. Glory be to Thee. Preserve us from doom of fire. <laughs> Our Lord, whom thou causest to enter the fire, him indeed thou hast confounded. For evildoers there'll be no helpers. <laughs> Our Lord, lo, we have heard a crier calling unto faith. Believe ye in your Lord, so we believed. Our Lord, therefore forgive us our sins and remit from us our evil deeds and make us die the death of the righteous. <laughs> Our Lord, and give us that which Thou hast promised to us by Thy messengers. Confound us not upon the day of resurrection. Lo, Thou breakest not the tryst. <laughs> And their Lord hath heard them, and he saith, Lo, I suffer not the work of any worker, male or female, to be lost. Ye proceed one from another, so those who fled and were driven forth from their homes and suffered damage for my cause and fought and were slain, verily I shall remit their evil deeds from them, and verily I shall bring them into gardens underneath which rivers flow, a reward from Allah, and with Allah is the fairest of rewards. <laughs> Let not the vicissitude of the success of those who disbelieve in the land deceive thee, O Muhammad.
it is but a brief comfort and afterwards their habitation will be hell and ill abode. <laughs> But those who keep their duty to their Lord for them are gardens underneath which rivers flow, wherein they will be safe forever. A gift to welcome from their Lord, that which Allah hath in store is better for the righteous. <laughs> And lo, of the people of the scripture there are some who believe in Allah and that which is revealed unto you and that which was revealed unto them humbling themselves before Allah. They purchase not a trifling gain at the price of the revelations of Allah. Verily their reward is with their Lord and lo, Allah is swift to take account. يا أيها الذين آمنوا اصبروا وصابروا ورابطوا واتقوا الله لعلكم تفلحون. O ye who believe, endure, outdo all others in endurance, be ready, and observe your duty to Allah. in order that he may succeed. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. O mankind, be careful of your duty to your Lord, who created you from a single soul, and from it created its mate, and from them twain hath spread abroad a multitude of men and women. Be careful of your duty toward Allah in whom ye claim your rights of one another, and toward the wombs that bore you. Lo, Allah hath been a watcher over you. <laughs> كبيرا. 
give unto orphans their wealth, exchange not the good for the bad in your management thereof, nor absorb their wealth into your own wealth. Lo, that would be a great sin. <laughs> فَإِنْ خِفْتُمْ أَلَّا تَعْدِلُوا فَوَاحِدَةً أَوْ مَا مَلَكَتْ أَيْمَانُكُمْ بَارِكَ أَدْنَا أَلَّا تَعُولُوا And if ye fear that ye will not deal fairly by the orphans, marry of the women who seem good to you. two or three or four, and if ye fear that ye cannot do justice to so many, then one only, or the captives that your right hands possess. Thus it is more likely that ye will not do injustice. <laughs> And give unto the women whom ye marry free gift of their marriage portions. But if they of their own accord remit unto you a part thereof, then ye are welcome to absorb it in your wealth. Give not unto the foolish what is in your keeping of their wealth, which Allah hath given you to maintain, but feed and clothe them from it, and speak kindly unto them. <laughs> Prove orphans till they reach the marriageable age, then if you find them of sound judgment, deliver over unto them their fortune, and devour it not by squandering and in haste, lest they should grow up. Whoso of the guardians is rich, let him abstain generously from taking off the property of orphans, and whoso is poor, let him take thereof in reason for his guardianship. And when you deliver up their fortune unto orphans, have the transaction witnessed in their presence. Allah sufficeth as a reckoner. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Unto the men of a family belongeth a share of that which parents and near kindred leave, and unto the women a share of that which parents and near kindred leave, whether it be little or much, a legal share. And when kinsfolk and orphans and the needy are present at the division of the heritage, bestow on them therefrom and speak kindly unto them. <laughs> And let those fear in their behavior toward orphans, who, if they left behind them weak offspring, would be afraid for them. So let them mind their duty to Allah and speak justly. <laughs> Lo, those who devour the wealth of orphans wrongfully, they do but swallow fire into their bellies, and they will be exposed to burning flame. <laughs> Allah chargeth you concerning the provisions for your children, to the male the equivalent of the portion of two females, and if there be women more than two, then theirs is two-thirds of the inheritance, and if there be one only, then the half, and to his parents a sixth of the inheritance, if he have a son. And if he have no son, and his parents are his heirs, then to his mother appertaineth the third, and if he have brethren, 
than to his mother appertain of the sixth after any legacy he may have bequeathed or debt hath been paid. Your parents or your children, ye know not which of them is nearer unto you in usefulness. It is an injunction from Allah. Lo, Allah is knower, wise. <laughs> And unto you belongeth a half of that which your wives leave, if they have no child. But if they have a child, then unto you the fourth of that which they leave, after any legacy they may have bequeathed, or debt they may have contracted hath been paid. And unto them belongeth the fourth of that which ye leave, if ye have no child. But if ye have a child, then the eighth of that which ye leave, after any legacy ye may have bequeathed, or debt ye may have contracted, hath been paid. And if a man or a woman have a distant heir, having left neither parent nor child, and he or she have a brother or a sister, only on the mother's side, then to each of them twain, the brother and the sister, the sixth, and if they be more than two, then they shall be sharers in the third, after any legacy that may have been bequeathed, or debt contracted, not injuring the heirs by willing away, more than a third of the heritage hath been paid. A commandment from Allah. Allah is Noah indulgent. <laughs> These are the limits imposed by Allah. Whoso obeyeth Allah and his messenger, he will make him enter gardens underneath which rivers flow, where such will dwell forever, that will be the great success. <laughs> And whoso 
disobeyeth Allah and his messenger and transgresseth his limits, he will make him enter fire, where such will dwell forever. His will be a shameful doom. <laughs> As for those of your women who are guilty of lewdness, call to witness four of you against them. And if they testify to the truth of the allegation, then confine them to the houses until death take them, or until Allah appoint for them a way through new legislation. <laughs> And as for the two of you who are guilty thereof, punish them both. And if they repent and improve, then let them be. Lo, Allah is relenting, merciful. <laughs> Forgiveness is only incumbent on Allah toward those who do evil in ignorance and then turn quickly in repentance to Allah. These are they toward whom Allah relenteth. Allah is ever knower, wise. <laughs> The forgiveness is not for those who do ill deeds until when death attendeth upon one of them, he saith, Lo, I repent now, nor yet for those who die while they are disbelievers. For such we have prepared a painful doom. يا أيها الذين آمنوا لا يحل لكم أن ترثوا النساء كرها ولا تعضلوهن ولا تعضلوهن لتذهبوا ببعض ما آتيتموهن إلا أن يأتين بفاحشة مبينة وعاشروهن بالمعروف 
بالمعروف فإن كرهتموهن فعسى أن تكرهوا شيئا ويجعل الله فيه خيرا كثيرا O ye who believe, it is not lawful for you forcibly to inherit the women of your deceased kinsmen, nor that ye should put constraint upon them, that ye may take away a part of that which ye have given them, unless they be guilty of flagrant lewdness. But consort with them in kindness, for if ye hate them, it may happen that ye hate a thing wherein Allah hath placed much good. وَإِنْ أَرَدْتُمُ استبدال زوج مكان زوج وآتيتم إحداهن قنطارا فلا تأخذوا منه شيئا أتأخذونه بهتانا And if ye wish to exchange one wife for another, and ye have given unto one of them a sum of money, however great, take nothing from it. Would ye take it by the way of calumny and open wrong? <laughs> How can you take it back after one of you hath gone in unto the other and they have taken a strong pledge from you? And marry not those women whom your fathers married, except what hath already happened of that nature in the past. Lo, it was ever lewdness and abomination and an evil way. Inna Allah kana 
Forbidden unto you are your mothers and your daughters and your sisters and your father's sisters and your mother's sisters and your brother's daughters and your sister's daughters and your foster mothers and your foster sisters and your mothers-in-law and your stepdaughters who are under your protection born of your women unto whom you have gone in but if you have not gone in unto them then it is no sin for you to marry their daughters and the wives of your sons who spring from your own loins and it is forbidden unto you that ye should have two sisters together except what hath already happened of that nature in the past lo allah is ever forgiving merciful <laughs> وأحل لكم ما وراء ذلكم أن تبتغوا بأموالكم محصنين غير مسافحين فما And all married women are forbidden unto you save those captives whom your right hands possess. It is a decree of Allah for you. Lawful unto you are all beyond those mentioned, so that ye seek them with your wealth in honest wedlock, not debauchery. And those of whom ye seek content by marrying them, give unto them their portions as a duty. And there's no sin for you in what ye do by mutual agreement after the duty hath been done. Lo, Allah is ever knower, wise. <laughs> And whoso is not able to afford to marry free believing women, let them marry from the believing maids whom your right hands possess. Allah knoweth best concerning your faith. 
ye proceed one from another, so wed them by permission of their folk, and give unto them their portions in kindness, they being honest, not debauched, nor of loose conduct. And if when they are honorably married they commit lewdness, they shall incur the half of the punishment prescribed for free women in that case. This is for him among you who feareth to commit sin, but to have patience would be better for you. Allah is forgiving, merciful. <laughs> Allah would explain to you and guide you by the examples of those who were before you and would turn to you in mercy. Allah is knower, wise. And Allah would turn to you in mercy, but those who follow vain desires would have you go tremendously astray. Allah would make the burden light for you, for man was created weak. O ye who believe, squander not your wealth among yourselves in vanity, except it be a trade by mutual consent, and kill not one another. Lo, Allah is ever merciful unto you. <laughs> And whoso doeth that through aggression and injustice, we shall cast him into fire, and that is ever easy for Allah. <laughs> If ye avoid the great things which ye are forbidden, we will remit from you your evil deeds and make you enter at a noble gate. <laughs> And covet not the thing in which Allah hath made some of you excel others. Unto men a fortune from that which they have earned, and unto women a fortune from that which they have earned. Envy not one another, 
but ask Allah of His bounty. Lo, Allah is ever knower of all things. <laughs> And unto each we have appointed heirs of that which parents and near kindred leave. And as for those with whom your right hands have made a covenant, give them their due. Lo, Allah is ever witness over all things. <laughs> فالصالحات قانتات حافظات للغيب بما حفظ الله واللاتي تخافون نشوزهن فعظوهن Men are in charge of women because Allah hath made the one of them to excel the other and because they spend of their property for the support of women. So good women are the obedient, guarding in secret that which Allah hath guarded. As for those from whom you fear rebellion, admonish them and banish them to beds apart and scourge them. Then if they obey you, seek not a way against them. Lo, Allah is ever high, exalted, great. <laughs> And if ye fear a breach between them twain, the man and wife, appoint an arbiter from his folk and an arbiter from her folk. If they desire amendment, Allah will make them of one mind. Lo, Allah is ever knower aware. <laughs> And serve Allah and ascribe nothing as partner unto Him. 
show kindness unto parents, and unto near kindred, and orphans, and the needy, and unto the neighbor who is of kin unto you, and the neighbor who is not of kin, and the fellow traveler, and the wayfarer, and the slaves whom your right hands possess. Lo, Allah loveth not such as are proud and boastful. <laughs> Who hoard their wealth and enjoin avarice on others and hide that which Allah had bestowed upon them of His bounty. For disbelievers, we prepare a shameful doom. <laughs> And also those who spend their wealth in order to be seen of men and believe not in Allah nor the last day, whoso taketh Satan for a comrade, a bad comrade hath he. <laughs> What have they to fear if they believe in Allah and the last day and spend a right of that which Allah had bestowed upon them when Allah is ever aware of them and all they do? Lo, Allah wrongeth not even of the weight of an ant, and if there's a good deed, he will double it and will give the doer from his presence an immense reward. But how will it be with them when we bring of every people a witness and we bring thee, O Muhammad, a witness against these? <laughs> On that day, those who disbelieved and disobeyed the messenger will wish that they were level with the ground and they can hide no fact from Allah. Ya ayyuha alladhina amanu la taqrabu salata wa antum sukara hatta ta'lamu ma taquluna wa la juluban illa abiri sabilin hatta tagtasilu
believe, draw not near unto prayer when ye are drunken, till ye know that which ye utter, nor when ye are polluted, save when journeying upon the road till ye have bathed. And if ye be ill or on a journey, or one of you cometh from the closet, or ye have touched women, and ye find not water, then go to high clean soil, and rub your faces and your hands therewith. Lo, Allah is benign, forgiving. Alam tara ila alladhina utu nasiban min alkitab yashtaruna dhalalata wa yuriduna an tadillu s-sabir. Seest thou not those unto whom a portion of the scripture hath been given? How they purchase error and seek to make you Muslims err from the right way? Allah knoweth best who are your enemies. Allah is sufficient as a friend, and Allah is sufficient as a helper. Some of those who are Jews change words from their context and say, We hear and disobey. Hear thou as one who heareth not. And listen to us, distorting with their tongues and slandering religion. If they had said, we hear and we obey. Hear thou and look at us. It had been better for them and more upright. But Allah hath cursed them for their disbelief. So they believe not save a few. <laughs> آمنوا بما نزلنا مصدقا لما معكم من قبل أن نطمس وجوها فنردها على أدبارها فنردها على O ye unto whom the scripture hath been given, believe in what we have revealed confirming that which ye possess, before we destroy countenances so as to confound them, or curse them as we curse the Sabbath breakers of old time. The commandment of Allah is always executed. Allah 
Lo, Allah forgiveth not that a partner should be ascribed unto him. He forgiveth all save that to whom he will. Whoso ascribeth partners to Allah, he hath indeed invented a tremendous sin. Hast thou not seen those who praise themselves for purity? Nay, Allah purifieth whom he will, and they will not be wronged even the hair upon a date stone. See how they invent lies about Allah? That of itself is flagrant sin. Alam tara ila alladheena ootu naseeban min alkitabi yu'minoon bil jibti wa tawuti wa yakooloon lil alladheena kafaru وَيَقُولُونَ لِلَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا هَؤُلَاءِ أَهْدَى مِنَ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا سَبِيلًا Hast thou not seen those unto whom a portion of the scripture hath been given, how they believe in idols and false deities, and how they say of those idolaters who disbelieve, these are more rightly guided than those who believe. Those are they whom Allah hath cursed, and he whom Allah hath cursed Thou, O Muhammad, wilt find for him no helper. <laughs> or have they even a share in the sovereignty? Then in that case, they would not give mankind even the speck on a date stone. <laughs> O are they jealous of mankind because of that which Allah of his bounty hath bestowed upon them? For we bestowed upon the house of Abraham of old the scripture and wisdom, and we bestowed on them a mighty kingdom. And of them were some who believed therein, and of them were some who disbelieved therein. Hell is sufficient for their burning. <laughs> Hakima. 
Lo, those who disbelieve our revelations, we shall expose them to the fire. As often as their skins are consumed, we shall exchange them for fresh skins, that they may taste the torment. Lo, Allah is ever mighty, wise. <laughs> And as for those who believe and do good works, we shall make them enter gardens underneath which rivers flow, to dwell therein forever. There for them are pure companions, and we shall make them enter plenteous shade. <laughs> Lo, Allah commandeth you that ye restore deposits to their owners, and if ye judge between mankind, that ye judge justly. Lo, comely is this which Allah admonisheth you. Lo, Allah is ever hearer, seer. O ye who believe, obey Allah, and obey the Messenger and those of you who are in authority. And if ye have a dispute concerning any matter, refer it to Allah and the Messenger, if ye are in truth believers in Allah and the Last Day. That is better and more seemly in the end. <laughs> Hast thou not seen those who pretend that they believe in that which is revealed unto thee and that which was revealed before thee, how they would go for judgment in their disputes to false deities when they have been ordered to abjure them? Satan would mislead them far astray. <laughs> And 
when it is said unto them, Come unto that which Allah hath revealed and unto the Messenger, thou seest the hypocrites turn from thee with aversion. <laughs> How would it be if a misfortune smote them because of that which their own hands have sent before them? Then would they come unto thee, swearing by Allah that they were seeking naught but harmony and kindness. <laughs> Those are they, the secrets of whose hearts Allah knoweth. So oppose them and admonish them and address them in plain terms about their souls. <laughs> We sent no messenger save that he should be obeyed by Allah's leave. And if when they had wronged themselves, they had but come unto thee and asked forgiveness of Allah and asked forgiveness of the messenger, they would have found Allah forgiving, merciful. <laughs> But nay, by thy Lord they will not believe in truth until they make thee judge of what is in dispute between them and find within themselves no dislike of that which thou decidest, and submit with full submission. <laughs> And if we had decreed for them, lay down your lives or go forth from your dwellings, but few of them would have done it. Though if they did what they are exhorted to do, it would be better for them and more strengthening. <laughs> And then we should bestow upon them from our presence an immense reward. And should guide them unto a straight path.
Whoso obeyeth Allah and the Messenger, they are with those unto whom Allah hath shown favor of the prophets and the saints and the martyrs and the righteous. The best of company are they. That is the bounty of Allah, and Allah sufficeth as Noah. O ye who believe, take your precautions, then advance the proven ones, or advance altogether. Lo, among you there is he who loitereth, and if disaster overtook you, he would say, Allah hath been gracious unto me since I was not present with them. And if a bounty from Allah befell you, he would surely cry as if there had been no love between you and him. Oh, would that I had been with them, then should I have achieved a great success. <laughs> Let those fight in the way of Allah who sell the life of this world for the other. Whoso fighteth in the way of Allah, be he slain or be he victorious, on him we shall bestow a vast reward. وَمَا لَكُمْ لَا تُقَاتِلُونَ فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ وَالْمُسْتَضْعَفِينَ مِنَ الرِّجَالِ وَالنِّسَاءِ وَالْوِلْدَانِ الَّذِينَ يَقُولُونَ How should ye not fight for the cause of Allah and of the feeble among men and of the women and the children who are crying? Our Lord, bring us forth from out this town of which the people are oppressors. O, oh, give us from thy presence some protecting friend. O, oh, give us from thy presence some defender. <laughs> Oh, 
Those who believe do battle for the cause of Allah, and those who disbelieve do battle for the cause of idols. So fight the minions of the devil. Lo, the devil's strategy is ever weak. Alam tara ila alladhina qila lahum kuffu aydiyakum wa aqimu salata wa atu zakata falamma kutiba alayhimu alqitaa Hast thou not seen those unto whom it was said, Withhold your hands, establish worship, and pay the poor due? But when fighting was prescribed for them, behold, a party of them fear mankind, even as they fear of Allah, or with greater fear, and say, Our Lord, why hast thou ordained fighting for us? If only thou wouldst give us respite yet a while. Say unto them, O Muhammad, the comfort of this world is scant. The hereafter will be better for him who wardeth off evil, and you will not be wronged the down upon a date stone. <laughs> Wheresoever ye may be, death will overtake you, even though ye were in lofty towers. Yet, if a happy thing befalleth them, they say, This is from Allah. And if an evil thing befalleth them, they say, This is of thy doing, O Muhammad. Say unto them, All is from Allah. What is amiss with these people that they come not nigh to understand a happening? <laughs> Whatever a good befalleth thee, O man, it is from Allah, and whatever of ill befalleth thee, it is from thyself. We have sent thee, Muhammad, as a messenger unto mankind, and Allah is sufficient as witness. <laughs> 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 
Whoso obeyeth the messenger obeyeth Allah, and whoso turneth away, we have not sent thee as a warder over them. <laughs> And they say, it is obedience, but when they have gone forth from thee, a party of them spend the night in planning other than what thou sayest. Allah recordeth what they plan by night. So oppose them and put thy trust in Allah. Allah is sufficient as trustee. <laughs> Will they not then ponder on the Qur'an? If it had been from other than Allah, they would have found therein much incongruity. <laughs> لَوْلَا فَضْلُ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَتُهُ لَاتَّبَعْتُمُ الشَّيْطَانَ إِلَّا قَلِيلًا And if any tidings whether of safety or fear came unto them, they noise it abroad. Whereas if they had referred it to the messenger and such of them as are in authority, those among them who are able to think out the matter would have known it. If it had not been for the grace of Allah upon you and his mercy, ye would have followed Satan, save a few of you. <laughs> So fight, O Muhammad, in the way of Allah. Thou art not taxed with the responsibility of anyone except for thyself, and urge on the believers. Peradventure, Allah will restrain the might of those who disbelieve. Allah is stronger in might and stronger in inflicting punishment. <laughs> Whoso interveneth in a good cause will have the reward thereof, and whoso interveneth in an evil cause will bear the consequence thereof. Allah overseeth all things. Shay 
When ye are greeted with a greeting, greet ye with better than it, or return it. Lo, Allah taketh count of all things. Allahu la ilaha illa huwa la yajma'annakum ila yawmil qiyamati la rayba fiyih. Wa man asdaqu min Allahi haditha. Allah, there's no God save Him. He gathereth you all unto a day of resurrection whereof there's no doubt. Who is more true in statement than Allah? <laughs> What aileth you that ye are become two parties regarding the hypocrites when Allah cast them back to disbelief because of what they earned? Seek ye to guide him whom Allah hath sent astray? He whom Allah sendeth astray, for him thou, O Muhammad, canst not find a road. <laughs> They long that ye should disbelieve, even as they disbelieve, that ye may be upon a level with them. So choose not friends from them till they forsake their homes in the way of Allah. If they turn back to enmity, then take them and kill them wherever ye find them, and choose no friend nor helper from among them. <laughs> Except those who seek refuge with the people between whom and you there's a covenant who come unto you because their hearts forbid them to make war on you or make war on their own folk. Had Allah willed, he could have given them power over you so that assuredly they would have fought you. So if they hold aloof from you and wage not war against you and offer you peace, Allah allows you no way against them. <laughs> Fee, <laughs> 
Ye will find others who desire that they should have security from you and security from their own folk. So often as they are returned to hostility, they are plunged therein. If they keep not aloof from you, nor offer you peace, nor hold their hands, then take them and kill them wherever ye find them. Against such we have given you clear warrant. <laughs> وَمَنْ قَتَلَ مُؤْمِنًا خَطَأً فَتَحْرِيرُ رَقَبَةٍ مُؤْمِنَةٍ وَدِيَةٌ مُسَلَّمَةٌ إِلَىٰ أَهْلِهِ وَدِيَةٌ مُسَلَّمَةٌ إِلَىٰ أَهْلِهِ فَإِن كَانَ مِن قَوْمٍ عَدُوٍّ لَّكُمْ وَهُوَ مُؤْمِنٌ فَتَحْرِيرُ رَقَبَةٍ مُّؤْمِنَةٍ وَإِن كَانَ مِن قَوْمٍ بَيْنَكُمْ وَبَيْنَهُمْ مِيثَاقٌ فَذِيَةٌ مُسَلَّمَةٌ إِلَىٰ أَهْلِهِ وَتَحْرِيرُ رَقَبَةٍ مُؤْمِنَةٍ أَمَنْ لَمْ يَجِدْ فَصِيَامُ شَهْرَيْنِ تَتَابِعَيْنِ تَوْبَةً مِنَ اللَّهِ وَكَانَ اللَّهُ عَلِيمًا حَكِيمًا It is not for a believer to kill a believer unless it be by mistake. He who hath killed a believer by mistake must set free a believing slave and pay the blood money to the family of the slain unless they remit it as a charity. If he the victim be of a people hostile unto you and he is a believer, then the penance is to set free a believing slave. And if he cometh of a folk between whom and you there is a covenant, then the blood money must be paid unto his folk and also a believing slave must be set free. And whoso hath not the wherewithal must fast two consecutive months, a penance from Allah. Allah is knower wise. <laughs> وَغَضِبَ اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ وَلَعَنَهُ وَأَعَدَّ لَهُ عَذَابًا عَظِيمًا Whoso slayeth a believer of set purpose, his reward is hell forever. Allah is wrath against him, and he hath cursed him, and prepared for him an awful doom. Ya ayyuhal ولا 
كذلك كنتم من قبل فمن الله عليكم فتبينوا إن الله كان بما تعملون خبيرا O ye who believe when ye go forth to fight in the way of Allah be careful to discriminate and say not unto one who offereth you peace. Thou art not a believer, seeking the chance profits of this life, so that ye may despoil him. With Allah are plenteous spoils. Even thus, as he now is, were ye before, but Allah hath since then been gracious unto you. Therefore, take care to discriminate. Allah is ever informed of what ye do. <laughs> Those of the believers who sit still other than those who have a disabling hurt are not on an equality with those who strive in the way of Allah with their wealth and lives. Allah hath conferred on those who strive with their wealth and lives a rank above the sedentary. Unto each Allah hath promised good, but he hath bestowed on those who strive a great reward above the sedentary. <laughs> Degrees of rank from him and forgiveness and mercy. Allah is ever forgiving, merciful. <laughs> Lo, as for those whom the angels take in death while they wrong themselves, the angels will ask, In what were ye engaged? They will say, We were oppressed in the land. The angels will say, Was not Allah's earth spacious that you could have migrated therein? As for such, their habitation will be hell and evil journeys end. <laughs> Thank you.
Except the feeble among men and the women and the children who are unable to devise a plan and are not shown away. As for such, it may be that Allah will pardon them. Allah is ever clement, forgiving. Whoso migrateth for the cause of Allah will find much refuge and abundance in the earth, and whoso forsaketh his home, a fugitive unto Allah and his messenger, and death overtaketh him, his reward is then incumbent on Allah. Allah is ever forgiving, merciful. وَإِذَا ضَرَبْتُمْ فِي الْأَرْضِ فَلَيْسَ عَلَيْكُمْ جُنَاحٌ أَن تَقْصُرُوا مِنَ الصَّلَاةِ إِنْ خِفْتُمْ أَنْ يَفْتِنَكُمُ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا إِنَّ الْكَافِرِينَ كَانُوا When ye go forth in the land, it is no sin for you to curtail your worship if ye fear that those who disbelieve may attack you. In truth, the disbelievers are an open enemy to you. <laughs> وَلْيَأْخُذُوا أَسْلِحَتَهُمْ فَإِذَا سَجَدُوا فَلْيَكُونُوا مِنْ وَرَائِكُمْ فَإِذَا سَجَدُوا فَلْيَكُونُوا مِنْ وَرَائِكُمْ وَلْتَأْتِ طَائِفَةٌ And 
when thou, O Muhammad, art among them and arrangest their worship for them, let only a party of them stand with thee to worship and let them take their arms. Then when they have performed their prostrations, let them fall to the rear and let another party come that hath not worshipped and let them worship with thee and let them take their precaution and their arms. Those who disbelieve long for you to neglect your arms and your baggage that they may attack you once for all. It is no sin for you to lay aside your arms if rain impedeth you or ye are sick. But take your precaution. Lo, Allah prepareth for the disbelievers shameful punishment. <laughs> When ye have performed the act of worship, remember Allah standing, sitting and reclining. And when ye are in safety, observe proper worship. Worship at fixed hours hath been enjoined on the believers. Relent not in the pursuit of the enemy. If ye are suffering, lo, they suffer even as ye suffer, and ye hope from Allah that for which they cannot hope. Allah is ever knower, wise. <laughs> Lo, we reveal unto thee the scripture with the truth that thou mayst judge between mankind by that which Allah showeth thee. And be not thou a pleader for the treacherous. <laughs> And seek forgiveness of Allah. Lo, Allah is ever forgiving, merciful. <laughs> And plead not on behalf of people who deceive themselves. Lo, Allah loveth not one who is treacherous and sinful. <laughs> They seek to hide from men and seek not to hide from Allah. He is with them when by night they hold discourse displeasing unto Him. Allah ever surroundeth what they do. Do 
Lo ye are they who pleaded for them in the life of the world, but who will plead with Allah for them on the day of resurrection, or who will then be their defender? <laughs> Yet, whoso doeth evil or wrongeth his own soul, then seeketh pardon of Allah, will find Allah forgiving, merciful. <laughs> Whoso committeth sin committeth it only against himself. Allah is ever knower, wise. And whoso committeth a delinquency or crime, then throweth the blame thereof upon the innocent, hath burdened himself with falsehood and a flagrant crime. <laughs> But for the grace of Allah upon thee, Muhammad, and his mercy, a party of them had resolved to mislead thee, but they will mislead only themselves, and they will hurt thee not at all. Allah revealeth unto thee the scripture and wisdom, and teacheth thee that which thou knewest not. The grace of Allah toward thee hath been infinite. <laughs> There's no good in much of their secret conferences save in him who enjoineth almsgiving and kindness and peacemaking among the people. Whoso doeth that, seeking the good pleasure of Allah, we shall bestow on him a vast reward. <laughs> Oh, 
غير سبيل المؤمنين نوليه ما تولى ونصله جهنم نوليه ما تولى ونصله جهنم وساءت مصيرا and whoso opposeth the messenger after the guidance of Allah hath been manifested unto him and followeth other than the believer's way, we appoint for him that unto which he himself hath turned and expose him unto hell, a hapless journey's end. <laughs> وَمَنْ يُشْرِكْ بِاللَّهِ فَقَدْ ضَلَّ ضَلَالًا بَعِيدًا Lo, Allah pardoneth not that partners should be ascribed unto him. He pardoneth all save that to whom he will. Whoso ascribeth partners unto Allah hath wandered far astray. They invoke in his stead only females. They pray to none else than Satan, a rebel. Whom Allah cursed, and he said, Surely I will take of thy bondman an appointed portion. And surely I will lead them astray, and surely I will arouse desires in them, and surely I will command them, and they will cut the cattle's ears, and surely I will command them, and they will change Allah's creation. Whoso chooseth Satan for a patron instead of Allah is verily a loser, and his loss is manifest. <laughs> He promiseth them and stirreth up desires in them, and Satan promiseth them only to beguile. For such their habitation will be hell, and they will find no refuge therefrom. Allah 
But as for those who believe and do good works, we shall bring them into gardens underneath which rivers flow, wherein they will abide forever. It is a promise from Allah in truth, and who can be more truthful than Allah in utterance? <laughs> It will not be in accordance with your desires, nor the desires of the people of the scripture. He who doeth wrong will have the recompense thereof, and will not find against Allah any protecting friend or helper. <laughs> And whoso doeth good works, whether of male or female, and he or she is a believer, such will enter paradise, and they will not be wronged, the dint in a date stone. <laughs> Who is better in religion than he who surrendereth his purpose to Allah while doing good to men and followed the tradition of Abraham, the upright? Allah himself chose Abraham for friend. Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. Allah ever surroundeth all things. <laughs> They consult thee concerning women. Say, Allah giveth you decree concerning them, and the scripture which hath been recited unto you giveth decree concerning female orphans and those unto whom ye give not that which is ordained for them, though ye desire to marry them. And concerning the weak among children, 
and that ye should deal justly with orphans. Whatever good ye do, lo, Allah is ever aware of it. <laughs> If a woman fareth ill treatment from her husband or desertion, it is no sin for them twain if they make terms of peace between themselves. Peace is better. But greed hath been made present in the minds of men. If ye do good and keep from evil, lo, Allah is ever informed of what ye do. <laughs> Ye will not be able to deal equally between your wives, however much ye wish to do so. But turn not altogether away from one, leaving her as in suspense. If ye do good and keep from evil, lo, Allah is ever forgiving, merciful. <laughs> But if they separate, Allah will compensate each out of his abundance. Allah is ever all-embracing, all-knowing. Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. And we charge those who receive the scripture before you, and we charge you that ye keep your duty toward Allah. And if ye disbelieve, lo, unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth. And Allah is ever absolute owner of praise. <laughs> Unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and whatsoever is in the earth, and Allah is sufficient as defender. <laughs> If he will, he can remove you, O people, and produce others in your stead. Allah is able to do that.
Whoso desireth the reward of the world, let him know that with Allah is the reward of the world and the hereafter. Allah is ever hearer, seer. <laughs> O ye who believe, be ye staunch in justice, witnesses for Allah, even though it be against yourselves or your parents or your kindred, whether the case be of a rich man or a poor man, for Allah is nearer unto both than ye are. So follow not passion, lest ye lapse from truth. And if ye lapse or fall away, then lo, Allah is ever informed of what ye do. <laughs> O ye who believe, believe in Allah and His Messenger and the Scripture which He hath revealed unto His Messenger and the scripture which he revealed aforetime. Whoso disbelieveth in Allah and his angels and his scriptures and his messengers and the last day, he verily hath wandered far astray. <laughs> Lo, those who believe, then disbelieve, and then again believe, then disbelieve, and then increase in disbelief. Allah will never pardon them, nor will He guide them unto a way. <laughs> Bear unto the hypocrites the tidings that for them there's a painful doom. <laughs> Lord, 
Those who choose disbelievers for their friends instead of believers, do they look for power at their hands? Lo, all power appertaineth to Allah. <laughs> He hath already revealed unto you in the scripture that when ye hear the revelations of Allah rejected and derided, ye sit not with them who disbelieve and mock until they engage in some other conversation. Lo, in that case, if ye stayed, ye would be like unto them. Lo, Allah will gather hypocrites and disbelievers all together into hell. <laughs> Those who wait upon occasion in regard to you, and if a victory cometh unto you from Allah, say, are we not with you? And if the disbelievers meet with a success, say, Had we not the mastery of you, and did we not protect you from the believers? Allah will judge between you at the day of resurrection, and Allah will not give the disbelievers any way of success against the believers. <laughs> Lo, the hypocrites seek to beguile Allah, but it is Allah who beguileth them. When they stand up to worship, they perform it languidly and to be seen of men and are mindful of Allah but little. <laughs> Swaying between this and that, belonging neither to these nor to those, 
He whom Allah causeth to go astray, thou, O Muhammad, wilt not find a way for him. <laughs> believe, choose not disbelievers for your friends in place of believers. Would ye give Allah a clear warrant against you? <laughs> Lo, the hypocrites will be in the lowest deep of the fire and thou wilt find no helper for them. وَسَوْفَ يُؤْتِي اللَّهُ الْمُؤْمِنِينَ أَجْرًا عَظِيمًا Save those who repent and amend and hold fast to Allah and make their religion pure for Allah only. Those are with the believers and Allah will bestow on the believers an immense reward. مَا يَفْعَلُ اللَّهُ What concern hath Allah for your punishment if ye are thankful for his mercies and believe in him? Allah was ever responsive, aware. Allah loveth not the utterance of harsh speech save by one who hath been wronged. Allah is ever hearer, knower. If ye do good openly or keep it secret or forgive evil, lo, Allah is ever forgiving, powerful. <laughs> Lo, those who disbelieve in Allah and His messengers and seek to make distinction between Allah and His messengers and say, we believe in some and disbelieve in others and seek to choose a way in between. <laughs> Such are disbelievers in truth, 
and for disbelievers we prepare a shameful doom. <laughs> But those who believe in Allah and His messengers and make no distinction between any of them, unto them Allah will give their wages. And Allah was ever forgiving, merciful. فقد سألوا موسى أكبر من ذلك فقالوا أرنا الله جهرة فأخذتهم الصائقة بظلمهم ثم اتخذوا العجل The people of the scripture ask of thee that thou shouldst cause an actual book to descend upon them from heaven. They ask a greater thing of Moses aforetime, for they said, Show us Allah plainly. The storm of lightning seized them for their wickedness. Then even after that, they chose the calf for worship after clear proofs of Allah's sovereignty had come unto them. And we forgave them that and we bestowed on Moses evident authority. <laughs> And we caused the mount to tar above them at the taking of their covenant, and we bade them, Enter the gate prostrate, and we bade them, Transgress not the Sabbath, and we took from them a firm covenant. <laughs> Then because of their breaking of their covenant and their disbelieving in the revelations of Allah and their slaying of the prophets wrongfully and their saying, Our hearts are hardened. Nay, but Allah hath set a seal upon them for their disbelief so that they believe not, save a few. <laughs> And because of their disbelief and of their speaking against Mary, a tremendous calumny.
بِغَلَهُمْ وَإِنَّ الَّذِينَ اخْتَلَفُوا فِيهِ لَفِي شَكٍ مِّنْهِ مَا لَهُمْ بِهِ مِنْ عِلْمٍ إِلَّا اتِّبَاعًا وَمَا قَتَلُوهُ يَقِينًا And because of their saying, we slew the Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary, Allah's messenger. They slew him not, nor crucified, but it appeared so unto them. And lo, those who disagree concerning it are in doubt thereof. They have no knowledge thereof, save pursuit of a conjecture. They slew him not for certain. <laughs> But Allah took him up unto himself. Allah was ever mighty wise. There is not one of the people of the scripture but will believe in him before his death and on the day of resurrection he will be a witness against them. Because of the wrongdoing of the Jews, we forbade them good things which were before made lawful unto them, and because of their much hindering from Allah's way. and of their taking usury when they were forbidden it, and of their devouring people's wealth by false pretenses. We have prepared for those of them who disbelieve a painful doom. <laughs> But those of them who are firm in knowledge and the believers believe in that which is revealed unto thee and that which was revealed before thee, especially the diligent in prayer and those who pay the poor due, the believers in Allah and the last day. Upon these we shall bestow immense reward. <laughs> والنبيين من بعده وأوحينا إلى إبراهيم وإسحاق 
إسماعيل وإسحاق ويعقوب والأسباط والأسباط وعيسى وأيوب ويونس وهارون وسليمان وآتينا داود زبورا Lo, we inspire thee as we inspired Noah and the prophets after him. as we inspired Abraham and Ishmael and Isaac and Jacob and the tribes and Jesus and Job and Jonah and Aaron and Solomon and as we imparted unto David the Psalms. وَرُسُلًا قَدْ قَصَصْنَاهُمْ عَلَيْكَ مِنْ قَبْلُ وَرُسُلًا لَمْ نَقْصُصْهُمْ عَلَيْكَ وَكَلَّمَ اللَّهُ مُوسَى تَكْلِيمًا And messengers we have mentioned unto thee before, and messengers we have not mentioned unto thee. And Allah spake directly unto Moses. وَكَانَ اللَّهُ عَزِيزًا حَكِيمًا Messengers of good cheer and of warning in order that mankind might have no argument against Allah after the messengers. Allah was ever mighty, wise. لَكِنِ اللَّهُ يَشْهَدُ بِمَا أَنزَلَ إِلَيْكَ But Allah Himself testifieth concerning that which He hath revealed unto thee. In His knowledge hath He revealed it, and the angels also testify. And Allah is sufficient witness. <laughs> Lo, those who disbelieve and hinder others from the way of Allah, they verily have wandered far astray. Lo, those who disbelieve and deal in wrong, Allah will never forgive them. Neither will he guide them unto a road. Except the road of hell, wherein they will abide forever, and that is ever easy for Allah. O mankind, the messenger hath come unto you with the truth from your Lord. Therefore believe, it is better for you. 
But if ye disbelieve, still lo, unto Allah belongeth whatsoever is in the heavens and the earth. Allah is ever knower, wise. O people of the scripture, do not exaggerate in your religion nor utter aught concerning Allah save the truth. The Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary, was only a messenger of Allah, and his word which he conveyed unto Mary and a spirit from him. So believe in Allah and his messengers, and say not three, seize, it is better for you. Allah is only one God. Far is it removed from his transcendent majesty that he should have a son. His is all that is in the heavens and all that is in the earth, and Allah is sufficient as defender. <laughs> The Messiah will never scorn to be a slave unto Allah, nor will the favored angels. Whoso scorneth his service and is proud, all such will he assemble unto him. As for those who believed and did good works, unto them will he pay their wages in full, adding unto them of his bounty. And as for those who were scornful and proud, them will he punish with a painful doom. And they will not find for them against Allah any protecting friend or helper. Mankind, now hath a proof from your Lord come unto you, and we have sent down unto you a clear light. O 
as for those who believe in Allah and hold fast unto Him, them He will cause to enter into His mercy and grace and will guide them unto Him by a straight road. They ask thee for a pronouncement. Say, Allah hath pronounced for you concerning distant kindred. If a man die childless and he have a sister, hers is half the heritage, and he would have inherited from her had she died childless. And if there be two sisters, then theirs are two thirds of the heritage. And if they be brethren, men and women, unto the male is the equivalent of the share of two females. Allah expoundeth unto you, so that ye err not. Allah is knower of all things. <laughs> 